here. And then she sends a little letter. <laughs> this is new. So we'll just start from the beginning. I do like our Ouija board driven. Oh, I'm so glad the stream is working. Yay! The Paper Mario art style is incredible. It's adorable. I have a little Paper Mario boo on my 3DS. You do? Yeah, it's cute. Is that an arm's reach right now? If not... Yeah, it is. Well, yeah? I can get it. It's, 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 it's okay. Oh, so, the, it's so cute, the, the, the Koopa is bringing the mail. It's kind of fucked up that Luigi has to live in a house that just says Mario on it. <laughs> I didn't notice that. Unless we're going by uh, the movie rules, which dictates <laughs> that their last name is Mario, in which case it's like kind of okay. Maybe the, <clears throat> if we're going by the rules of the house, Luigi's name is probably on the back. <laughs> <laughs> probably. I think like Luigi's like, hey, you got a letter from Peach, I'm just going to read it. How's that sound? What do you think is in the jars? Because, like, you pointed out, like, yeah. everything's color-coded. There are two jars, one with green goop mm -hmm. in it, one with red goop in it. What is that supposed to be? Uh, jelly. Mario jelly? <laughs> Mario jelly. Ugh. Maybe that's what they eat. Like, we actually don't know what they, like, <laughs> That's eat. a good point. Well, wait, is there food in this game? Yeah. There's, like, apples There's, like, shit, right? you can eat a dried mushroom. There's not apples. Okay. You can eat, you can go get everything cooked. Well, you'll, you'll just see. You'll see later. I want to say birth by sleep was bad because they're gone. <laughs> Alright, here's the weathered old map. Man, I love how deep these blues are. It's a colorful ass game. Yeah, they're really cool. A lot of good primary colors. That, that boat is like all red, yellow, and blue. And white. That's a really cute boat. I want to say it stays in the port for a while. What you have to do is you have to get on the boat and then get knocked out on purpose and then come back when you know surf. And then you can just find the truck and use strength on it and that's how you get Waluigi. <laughs> yeah. I mean, actually, you can control different characters in this game. I'm not, I'm not talking about partners either. There's like a brief mode. You'll, you'll see later. I think someone was telling me about this. I think you were. There's a part, Probably me. There's a part where, that involves Peach. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, those are my favorites. Cool. It's just really cute. Paper Mario Peach is just everyone's waifu, I think. Does she have a distinct personality from regular Peach? Um, I mean, <laughs> there's something about her that's really special to me, mm -hmm. and it's really dumb. And I just, I don't want to, I don't want to talk about it yet. Okay, yeah. No, don't give anything away. So we're here. We're at Rogue Rogue Pert. Is that you? No, that's you. Oh, my bad. Zoop. I it... oh, that's such a cute boat. It's a good looking boat. It's very patriotic. <laughs> yeah, it is. I wonder who's piloting this boat. You know, I don't I don't think we ever know. They're trying to dissuade me from going to Robeport. <laughs> if you think there's a princess, you can get off here. That's cool. I mean... Whoever dropped Peach off here definitely shouldn't have. Yeah. Like, somebody definitely messed up. Well, she came with Toadsworth, though. So. The little Avenue sailor... Avenue bit of advice. <laughs> yeah, the bottoms are so cute. The sailor bottoms. They look great. The little baby sailor Toads are, like, the cutest thing in the world. Especially that little green one who's worried for his life, maybe. I don't know why he's worried. And you know a lot about this game. Yeah. You were telling me you just did a playthrough, like, not that long ago, right? Yeah, I, I forced my friend to play it. And he had me playing both of the Monkey Island games in exchange for me. Do you want pal? A princess in a pink dress? <laughs> I'm getting very... I'm getting a lot of, uh... Of, uh... Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack vibes from this. It doesn't... It's not that... It doesn't stay like this, for sure. Right. Like, this town is really cool, though. Oh, yay! Get away from me, freak. There's, there she is. That's her. The it girl. The Goomba? Yeah, it's Goombella. The Crystal Stars. Okay, maybe I did play this game, because I remember going around and getting these various seven Crystal Star ladies and getting some powers. Ladies. Or, there's at least one lady one, right? The stars aren't ladies. They're just stars. 
One, there was a, definitely a Paper Mario game I played with these stars that had different personalities. Oh, was that the original Paper Mario? Maybe. A lot of death threats for a Mario game. Like, there's already been two or three. This game is very weird for a Mario game. Like, Lord it Crumb. definitely does a lot of stuff. Albuquerque says Gabella rules, and, and they're right, because Gabella does rule. I like her too. She's adorable. She's so cute. Look at her. I wanted to help her out, but I gotta talk to this dude. He's got a propeller made of bones. I love him. Hoof. No, it says huff, hoof, harf, horf, half. <laughs> the five vowels. <laughs> That's true. What, are you, what about my bones? Oh, ever loving. Mm-hmm. Corkin. <laughs> Av That's a horrible thing to say, dude. I know. That is really bad. That's a really fucked up thing. <laughs> you are not right. Am I right? How about you, though? Oh, because... He's the color of... Lot they're already exploring a lot of uh, things about, like, the nature of death in the Mario universe. <laughs> Mario's like, look, I did not ask for this. The old crump -a bomb I love Lord Crump. It's a great name. Yeah, it is. We're going straight into the battle system. Star sprites. So, Slagar is pointing out that what I was thinking of was the star sprites from uh, the first game. Yeah, that's what I thought. Freak of the week, she calls him. Cabela's great. Okay. Sorry, Lord Crump. Oh, you're catching wow. Up the pick. wow, that was perfectly timed with that hammer. I think I was. Oh, that was rumble, actually. Yeah. It's cool. Yes. Good job. I dot. Just my instincts are kicking in here. Did I screw that up? Yeah, you did. Mm. Nice. Yeah, blocking is so important in this game. There you go. Jumping is just never satisfying for me for some reason. The sounds aren't really there. I think it's the hammer is so final. Yeah. Cause you're, it really feels like you're charging it up instead of just tapping it out. Yeah. 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 Star points. That's my experience, right? Mm -hmm. And you can level up through star points. I think that was one of the main issues with Sticker Star, from what I heard, because I just don't want to dabble in that. I just I don't want to tarnish these fond memories I have. Yeah. But, um, there was no experience, right? Yeah, I heard there's like no level up system, right. so there's no point in fighting it like at all. Really. I've, yeah, that's actually what I heard too. Is that like you don't like random encounters? You don't get really any tangible rewards, so it's mm. like you just want to avoid them. And every time you have, they like you get in a battle, you're like, this is a hassle. And look at this. He's really using the power of the GameCube here to render all these 2D dudes. Isn't it dope? It looks great. Like you can walk through them though. Well, use your hammer. Oh, does it not do it? Oh, there we go. Where we did it. Go in like a giant sea. It's not doing anything? Hold on. I can't really like push through. Urgh. Oh, I think it's later that it matters. Okay. It's still just fun. Look at them. They're all fighting each other. Being cute. They think I'm there? Yeah, they do. That's... They think they're jumping you. <laughs> That's funny. X-Nots are really cool. I wasn't say cute, but I say cute way too much. We're gonna be saying that a lot during this game, I think. This game's adorable. It's a great looking character. Crump or all of the astronauts in general? Johnson! Has... There's one who's named Johnson. <laughs> My head canon is that they're all named Johnson. <laughs> nice head canon. Crud, they bolted. I love like Nintendo I mean... Treehouse translation versions of swearing. Mm. Uh oh. oh. Oh, dip. <laughs> Hello, Goombella. <laughs> University of Goom. Go, Goombas. Yeah. You can tell because there's brightly colored clothes, I think. Yeah, I think you can tell because he doesn't look like that Goomba walking around behind her. No. Or that mouse thief. I wish I looked like either of them. I actually really like the, the mouse thieves. It is called Rogue Port. Wow, look at that tough guy. The, the lazy Dugan, I think is, is his name. Is he a Yoshi? He's a Dugan. What's a Dugan? I don't know. Just a Yoshi with a nose and, like, dog-colored skin? He looks like a dog <laughs> Yoshi. <laughs> He's a Dugan. I don't know what a Dugan is. Oh, look at Oh, Pinatas! Yeah, Wait. yeah. They're, they're really 
opponent in this game. That's why I really was excited when you were talking shit about Piantas the other day. Are they like Secret Service Piantas? <laughs> I don't want to tell you. Okay. That's such a good part of the game. Alright. Also, keep an eye on like the background, because there's always a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. <laughs> wow. They're just, they're jumping those dudes in the background. <laughs> yeah, they are. Stay down, bro. <laughs> oh, they're like... <laughs> <laughs> they're the mob. Mobster pianos. <laughs> so this game is post-Sunshine, then, right? Yeah, it is. This conversation is happening, like, in real time behind me. I don't want to... <laughs> I definitely didn't play this game, then. This game's awesome. Shane Patchko is saying, I wish they had releases on the Wii U game shop. Yeah, me too. That'd be cool. They need to start putting out GameCube games on there, I think. Wow, Mario was really shocked. He was. He, you could hear it in his voice. <laughs> Toadsworth, I don't want to say he looks adorable, but just look he, at him. <laughs> Toadsworth is totally ready to accept the fact that Peach is just dead. He's just, <laughs> he's just like, well... I'm gonna go have some tea, cause I don't know what else to do. <laughs> She's like, <coughs> you're right. He is gonna get that tea. Heart points. Just drop on in. Someone got paid to write that. Yeah. I say. I I gotta. He's really huffing. He's a huffy guy. I love this concept that, like, Mario and Peach are famous yeah. in this universe. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. You just never see it acknowledged that often. Bowser in this game is, like, the weirdest incarnation of Bowser personality that I've seen. That's awesome. In my opinion. I don't know if anybody else agrees, but I love Bowser in Paper Mario. He's so funny. Let's go. No, she's in your part. Tight. She's adorable, and she has really cool powers. Okay, so she'll just tell me stuff. I can like talk to her. Mm -hmm. Got it. You can even. It's really in depth too. So is there like a lot of dialogue I can get from, yes. from her? Yes. Mm -hmm. Goomther. So tell you about each person individually if you can talk to no them. No way, really? Yeah. Holy crap. I want to go learn about that scared green toad. You should, actually. I don't remember his little tattle. It's not a tattle. It's oh, like... yeah, the ability's called tattle, though, right? In, in when you're fighting, but I call it tattle outside. I think that works. Just... Yeah. That's so much writing that they task themselves with. I know. Especially because she can tell you about each land. And, um... God, I love her professor. <laughs> He's a good-looking dude. Yeah, he is. Alright, we're gonna go learn about this toad. We're gonna backtrack a little bit. Oh, you have to hit X. Yeah, I just, I haven't heard, we haven't, he hasn't said this to us yet. Oh, that's true, he hasn't. That's a toad sailor. <laughs> but hey. Well, does that come up later, the brother thing? Mm. Wow. We just met. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you calling me out? <laughs> I like that she acknowledges that they have discreet personalities, but they don't have names. Mm -hmm. That's a bob -omb sailor. Isn't he the one who said it was okay that it just ended like a, a husband and wife squabble? Yeah, I. Me, <laughs> He's a pretty okay guy. Me, all around. Me and Bella don't agree on him. Tell me about this dude. Patch. Patch. I like that a Babam is named Pepatch, like the same sort <laughs> of naming structure. Do you gotta love that? I think that Gabella kind of. She's down? Yeah, I think she's kind of down. I think she's down with Babams in general, it seems like. She's cutting them a lot of slack. That's true, she has. Oh, 
Roadport theme is awesome. Look at this old, old George Washington Goomba. Or, oh. uh, old George Washington Mushroom Toad. That is Zest T. She's a chef. And it was Zest T. Did it? Like Zest T? <laughs> there are, <laughs> wait, there are contact lenses in the Mario universe? <laughs> yeah, it's actually a huge, a huge thing. Don't move. Okay. I mean, if. Not moving. <laughs> I'm just gonna. <laughs> Jokes. <laughs> She's got. You know, her vision might be poor, but her hearing's incredible. <laughs> she heard me step on her contact glass. <laughs> it made a loud crunch. <laughs> Mara's just like, no? Yeah, it's literally like, he's not gonna, I'm not gonna help you. You don't want to try and get past her? I might, I might later. That's her house. Actually, that's, you could just trash her house. Like, you could destroy it. And then go out there and be like, I just hey. messed up your house. Like, move. What are you gonna do about it? Yeah. Get out of my way. I think it only changes when you go into like a new screen. Yeah. Look at these wanted criminals in the background, like these cowboy dudes. Oh yeah. I almost slipped past her. I really like that. That's how they block off the west side of Rogueport. Like you literally cannot get there until her contact lens is shipped in. Zesty is a great name. Yeah. <laughs> Kitchen magician. I really like the way Gabella talks. The east side. Um, Azriel says more game volume. Oh, you know. Happily. There we go. Also, the, the, the music goes down when you're in a conversation, I think. It does. Hold on. One, two, three. I want to turn up for us a little bit too. Yeah. He just assumes that it was a robbery because it's Roadport. <laughs> Why look at this guy? What did he take? A lazy Dugan. Mm -hmm. I saw him and I remembered the title. Moose Civilian. So in that back area, like over this alley, yeah, in this alley, in this really shady alley, um, in the Japanese version, which I actually took it out, there was like I think it's on the right hand side. You can see where it was. There was like a an outline. See right over here, there was like an outline of a toad body, like a like, <laughs> like a, a chalk outline. Yeah, there was a chalk outline of a body that had gotten like murdered. That was too far though, I guess. Yeah, they took it out. I'm a wanted Goomba. That's that's good to know. Tell me about this one Goomba. McGoomba? A Goomba. It is nasty back here. It is. I don't I wanna know where the toad died. Like I don't remember exactly where it was. It's got gambling addictions. <laughs> this town is rough. Yeah, it actually is. Ugh. <laughs> this is not very Oh. Huh. You got a star piece. Congrats. Alright, right, oops. Yeah. Look at the bounty on that. Yeah, what is it's that? It's a Koopa. Yeah. It's a Koopa for sure, wearing a hat. The bounty is 8 million cents. Yes. Alrighty. I just, I feel like I want to take all this in. There's so much. There's a lot to do here. This is the beginning of Nintendo getting super tutorially in the 2000s. I also want to see what's on. There's like a signpost over here I want to read. I don't even remember what it says. The mm. Piata Syndicate and the Robos. Apparently, it says. <laughs> That's definitely what you just saw in the background. Mm -hmm. Should we go to the inn? Where, would you, where do you want to go? Um, we could go to. Actually, yeah, we should definitely go into the inn. There's a bar downstairs. 
Hell yeah. That was a lot of fun characters. Turn up. It? Oh, wow. That is Flavio. Oh, he's great looking. Yeah. Love Flavio. He's maybe a lemon. There. <laughs> Ellipses mean scram. Don't talk to me. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> not to me, he's not. Yeah. Look at the bartender. The bartender, I don't know what he is. He looks like some sort of bean or fruit. I, I called him the lima bean that sells drinks, because yeah. there's also a guy who sells drinks in another place, and he looks the same. He's the richest man in Rogueport. Mm -hmm. I love Flavio. At the Boom Bossa Boom Festival. Get some darts. Wow, those are some... Is that just poorly rendered, or...? I don't know. I, I think we were never meant to see it at this beautiful resolution here. Right. What's up with you? She's got human hair. She does. She's like... Toadette. I'm at full health, I'm good. How you doing, dude? Where's that tea? He's just worrying about her inside. He's an active senior. <laughs> I mean, he's not that active. No, apparently not. Clearly. Whew. Feels like a uh, night in the woods now. All this rooftop walking. Mm -hmm. Open at 11 a.m. today. I'm surprised you found that. Ooh, interesting. Mm -hmm. What I really like about Rogueport is um, it doesn't look... You can't really... When you go into different worlds, like, every world has walls, even if it's sky. Yeah. And uh, Rogueport just feels like you're in a really tall city. And then right. I explain it. Until you actually get up higher and you see where it ends. Oh, I feel like I just got robbed. You definitely did. Mario is so quiet in this game. <laughs> oh no. I should have spent. I should have just <coughs> taken 10 naps at the inn. That That's way they have no coins for this deal. I wonder what happened if that happens. I don't know. Alright. So there's Ooh. some sh shine sprites. I think his name is Merlin. Merlin. Yeah. Merlin. New move. Yeah, it's awesome. Be gone, though. You're not ready yet. They're so... This game is, like, big. You found him. Hey! <laughs> Alpha Kong is saying, I'm wondering if Nick's played the Mario and Luigi games. Yeah, I played Superstar Saga. I played... I did not play Bowser's Inside Story. I haven't played the 3DS one yet, either. I haven't um, played any of those actually. Which dude, is weird. You, third player <laughs> yeah. Mario, basically. Really? Yeah. Oh, I have played them then. It's weird to me that I haven't even. <laughs> I love all the Goomba names, like the female Goomba. He knows a lot of Lady Goombas. I'm just saying. Eliza Goom. Good memory. Mm. Oh, he's a teacher, right. Right. Go Goombas. Yep. You Goom. I like his song. Oh, I love it. It's dumb. so funny. It sounds like a dumb old man. Mm -hmm, it does. He's kind of reminiscent of um, Professor Egad. Yeah, he's like Goomba Gad. <laughs> Egoom. Egoom. Actually, they should hang out. They'd probably be really good friends. I, my, I, I bet you Egad worked at that university. I like to imagine that they do hang out. That's exciting. I mean, they're both, you know, married to their studies, so they can't, like, actually... Right. Is that why he just said he hasn't heard of Mario? He's like, he doesn't know what's hip these days? Yeah. And also, Egad's like a hermit that lives near a haunted mansion that doesn't actually exist, so... I don't think he knows anyone besides maybe Luigi and... Honestly, that's probably a really sad life in the Mario realm. Like, <laughs> yeah, imagine knowing nothing but Luigi. I mean, I'd be content, but maybe not if 
I, I lived here. He just called us tykes. Mm-hmm. I don't think Mario's a tyke. I think Mario's an old man. He does have like a mustache. Forty year old. Not a lot of tykes have mustaches. I mean, who knows how old Professor Frankly is, though. Mm. He's gonna help us find this legendary treasure. Many mysteries. I like that there are all these conflicting rumors about what it is. It makes it more mysterious. Mm-hmm. We must have the crystal stars. What's really cool about the game is that all of the dialogue is really consistent, mm -hmm. but a lot of it's like, there's a lot of rumors, and you get to like, kind of, it's a lot like talking to actual people. Mm. The dialogue is really what does this game. Well, it's just a really good part of the game, but it's probably like what makes it one of my favorites. I think that that's true of so many, like, I love Nintendo games where there's a ton of writing because it's always that polished. Like, mm -hmm. the Nintendo polish applies just as much to their scripts as it does their gameplay. Yeah, it does. Treehouse writes incredible games. Her eyeliner is very on point. It's adorable. Hey, guess what, dude? Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna hippity hoobada hamala huffala hoopala. <laughs> really? Ooh, people are talking about how cute a pip good Paper Mario anime would be. Oh wow, that would be great. If it was good, that would be amazing. I'd love to see like what that would look like in motion. Yeah, that would be actually interesting to see, because we do we do see a little bit of motion here, but yeah. definitely not to the extent that it would need to be at for an animated series. Like, it's funny. I'm I'm so used to the Paper Mario characters that didn't really animate. They were like flat. They were literally like just sprites, right? right, right. But in this, like Mario's hat wobbles when he breathes, and mm -hmm. so do his fists. And Bella's ponytail. Yeah. She goes like this. And she blinks. Wow. Oh no! Look, they've merged into one. I saw somebody mention the Glitz Pit being their favorite level, and I have to say that that was. Remember, I told you I think that your favorite level will be that. That was the level. I that one. That, yeah, I think that one's gonna be a favorite. Awesome. That one's really fun. I don't. I don't like thinking about like assault in the Mario universe. That that. This, the, the amount of, like, threats of harm that seem to occur in Rogue Port are distressing me. I mean, Gabelle's right, though. It is dangerous for her to walk around there. Yeah. Own. Like, we already saw. What's up with you? Ishnail. You can also fight him. I don't think I'm ready. Okay, good, because that's really boring. I feel like I remember. Yeah, it's good. It's not that. Professor Colorado. Do you know who that is? Mm -mm. Actually, I've never done a title on Professor Frankly. It's, there's at least one interesting thing it seems like so far for every tattle you do. A lot of people really like Glitch Pit. Sock Pen says Rock Hawk best character. Mm-hmm. Oops. You're not ready for the rock. Is that what he says? I don't know. I don't remember. He says a lot of things like that. Excellently. I think he says you're about to get rocked. <laughs> Afro Power says every time I look at Goombella I find another thing I love about her. I love her eyebrows. What? Oh my god, she does have eyebrows. And they sit oh, they're great. still on her, on her hat. On her, yeah, her miner's cap. God, she's adorable. She's so great. She's It's such a simple design, but it communicates so much about her, like that she's an archaeologist, you can kind of tell mm -hmm. immediately. And she's cute. That's, that's important. That is important. Also, uh, I, I like how Professor Frankly is kind of 
like it, when he was in her for a second. Yeah, it happened once before too, where they just they're overlapping. The hottie. <laughs> What's up, baby? <laughs> Damn. People ask me that all the time. <laughs> Damn. Kill him. Do Goombas barf? Do Goombas eat? I guess. I like how she only has one thing and they don't have two. <laughs> Come off it, sister. Nobody zings us like that. <laughs> Alright. Actually, Goobella in Rogueport is a really accurate portrayal of how it is to be, be a girl and walk around a town. Like a city? Yeah. Can't jump on him, right? No. When I left your house the other day, actually, that was fun. I got oh, to, yeah. I got off early. Like. On market. Near the theater and near everything? The, near the spooky theater, near the spooky porn one. Like, I'm assuming it was a porn theater. But that was fun. I got to walk really fast. Although this guy had a really nice rhyme. He said, at least turn around to see what you're turning down. <laughs> He's used that line before. He definitely this has. This dude definitely no, says knew. that 50 times a day. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I can swap between them. Yeah, that jump just doesn't do it for me. I think it's incredible that Goombella can not only tattle on people in town, but also in combat. No way, really? Yeah. Well, she tattles in combat and she'll tell you about them and stuff. Not each individual one, obviously, right. but just like the race. And that, like, that's very cool, though. There's just a lot of writing. <clears throat> but yeah, Mario and Luigi, those games, have like <coughs> timing-based combat. like. Right. It's just crazy how much time they spent, though. I mean, just yeah. like... I want to learn about Spikey. Oh, look at her little reading animation. I'm excited for you to know about style points. Spikey had a Goomba. What a creative name. <laughs> Nailing these blocks so far. Yeah, you're doing really good. So now I know his HP because she tattled. Yeah, so tattle tells you their HP too. Which is really important. Ooh. Blew it. Up, yeah. Um. Wow, he had one HP. Yeah. There we go. I think I'm still trying to get the timing of the jumps quite right. I still honestly haven't mastered them 100% just because I hate jumping. I just prefer to hammer when I can. Jumping's super important though. First strike. This game was, I think, the first RPG, or the original Paper Mario, sorry, it was the first RPG I ever enjoyed. Really? I had played other ones before, but this was the first one where I was ever like, I love this. And I think it was the timing based combat that sold me on it. It felt more active it than like. It more engaged than just making choices. Yeah. Because you're also playing. This was the first, like, hands down <clears throat> RPG that really did make me want to play other ones, which I haven't played that many, but this is definitely my favorite. I'm going to try to get jumps down. No. It has to be right before. Right before? So mm -hmm. not like at the same- alright. I think it was too early. It has to be- not before you lift off the ground, but right before you hit them. Yeah. I think I, I tried to do it right before I hit it, but I was too early. I got a coin. Am I ever going to get those 50 coins back? Hmm, I don't know. I think you can. There's a lot of little stuff you can do in a report. Alright. Yeah, he's up there. Hmm. That felt good to me, but... I just, I just gotta keep. Nope. Ludifer says they always like jumping more. Hmm. Right as you touch their head is what Zyzax is saying I yeah. should do. Okay. Right before you hit them. Oh, I got a badge, I think. No, that was the flower point. 
BFP. Can I hammer him from up here? Mm, I think probably. Yeah! Strategy. 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 I like that pronunciation better. No. Nope. Bah! Poop. No! Oh, dip! Oh, Gamela's gonna hurt herself. Really? Yeah. Crap. <laughs> she didn't even flinch, though. when it was above ground. Yeah, I, I believe that. Oh, secrets. Mm -hmm. A lot of secrets in Rogue Point. Cranky Joe says, what's a good starter RPG? I've only played Mario ones. Hmm. That's huh. a good question, actually. Oh, what? What is he? That's a Spinda? This thing's too powerful for me. Yeah, me neither. Woo! I can't believe I got that. Do they have like teeth? Oh god, that is what those are. I hadn't I, I couldn't figure it out. I thought they were little arms. There you go. Okay. And can I chain that more than once? Mm, later. Not with that okay. yet. I think Umbella actually is the one you Yeah. Multi-bonk. Multi-bonk. Someone was telling me, I was talking to someone recently there you about go. Got um. It. Super Mario RPG, which I've also never played, and apparently in that game you could, um... Oh, everyone lo that I know loves Super Mario same. RPG. Same. And I always get guilted over having never played it. Me too. Um, <laughs> but I was, I had a Genesis, so it wasn't up to me. Oh, I didn't, didn't dodge it. Um, but in that game you could apparently do the, uh, like, you could chain bounces off someone's head for basically Infinite? forever. Like, up to 99. Wow, that's incredible. That's really cool. Alrighty, so... Oh, Mario's looking tuckered. Yeah, that's a really good word for it, actually. He's tuckered He's out. He's definitely tuckered out. Here, let's, uh... Eat this mushroom. There we go. Hey, for Mario, like, th this game in particular... Um, always makes me feel really guilty when I have them running low on health. I, I just don't like having them run low because you can tell they're running low. Oh, like visibly? Well, they just, they sigh. They go, like Mario goes, ha, ah, ah, ha, and he oh. like pants. I feel like I can peel that. Not yet. You can like see in there. Look at how it's like moving. Mm -hmm. mm. That actually is really nice. It's another thing that I'll get later, I guess. Some mm -hmm. sort of fold me up into a paper airplane ability. This is, this is like my favorite thing in this game. <laughs> I was bummed. I love these so much. I love this guy. Can we trust this box? I think we should trust this box. <laughs> I like how it just gently rumbles. Mm-hmm. As it talks. It's cute. Alright, well I know where the key is. Right, you just saw it. Yeah. Mm. There was someone on Twitter who had this guy is their icon for a while, and I'm not sure who it was, but it was really exciting to me. I love when I see other people have Paper Mario themed <laughs> Twitters. Um, Green Hatharox is, uh, to answer the what's a good starter RPG uh, oh, yeah. question, said Chrono Trigger and Golden Sun. I actually really liked Golden Sun. Um, I've always wanted to play Chrono Trigger. I listen to the soundtrack a lot, which is bull because I haven't played it. Fools. <laughs> 
I love the music here too. It's great. Oh, I'm sucked into like a purple Monica <laughs> realm. Look how cute it is. Those are the brakes. That sucks, dude. I helped you. Luckily, like we live. Oh no! Is that the worst curse? You Trembling know, yet? <laughs> I can't help but chortle. Does it like hurt or something? No. <laughs> You're just a total freak now. Everyone's gonna laugh at you. <laughs> That's the only good thing, so you can fly for a while. What do I say? So yeah, I get it. It's terrible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Foolish fool. How does it feel being cursed and I've... unleashing the ultimate it's evil? Awful. What was that guy's beef? <coughs> Let's try it out. Air power said, "Puella magi Mario magica." <laughs> that was my first thought too. In that realm. <laughs> so wait, do I press B? Why? Why? Thank you. Mm -hmm. I hear a, a good story. Yeah. One time in uh, middle school, my friend had the original Xbox with Halo, and we had never played like a console first person shooter before. Okay. It was very new to us, and so we were playing Halo against each other. And I had this crappy gun, and I wanted to switch to the pistol because the pistol is amazing in that game. Mm -hmm. And I was like, Ryan, uh, what? what button do I press to switch weapons? And he said, why? And I said, because it's not fair that I have to use the assault rifle and you get to use the pistol. How do I switch weapons? And he's like, why? And I'm like, it's because you're basically cheating by not telling me how to do it. Like, just tell me. And he's like, why? And I'm like, because... And it, just, it was like a who's on first routine that... No, I've, it I've had that happen literally it while I was took like Star Fox. 45 seconds also for us to figure it out. Wait, so what do you press Y to do in Star Fox? <laughs> no. Um, God, I don't remember. I was playing Star Fox on GameCube. And then I eventually gave up and I just told my uncle it was Z because I got really mad. It had to do with when we were fighting each other in Star Fox. And, was it on, Dinosaur Planet or whatever the other one was? No, it was the one that had that really weird uh, fur, furry looking chip. Yeah, Star Nintendo Fox Crystal. Adventures Dinosaur Planet. That was Rare's last Nintendo game. Really? Before they got sold to Microsoft. There was a really fun multiplayer mode in that game that huh. I used to play with my cousins all the time. And I never actually played the actual game, which I should do. but Because we, we always were just constantly like fighting each other and I was always flippy. And um, I, I called him, he was cute, he was a frog and he had a hat. And anyway, so my Slippy? uncle was really... Yeah, Slippy. Was it Slippy? Yeah. I thought it was Slippy. Oh well. And um, <laughs> I was in the, the plane and my uncle was asking me, I don't remember what Y did. And I kept saying Y and I eventually just got mad and I told him it was Z. So he hit Z and Z actually makes it so that you fall out of the plane. And he was <laughs> flying over... Oh yeah, that was a dinosaur land. Yeah, he fell into the ocean and he got really mad at me because I got a kill from it. But it was a There's really... an eject button in Star Fox Adventures? Well, it's how you get out of the plane. Because you can also get in a Z tank. Huh. And that's what you hit. So then he hit Z, and then he fell out of the plane because he was flying at the same time. So we held out the map in front of the door. And now it's gonna tell us where the things are. Well, one of them. Okay. God, I can't believe we're not even in Petalburg yet. This is gonna be a long stream. It is. I'm so glad we're finally playing this, though. No, we do. I love this game so much. I'm glad you're, you. I can already tell you're enjoying it yeah. as much as I did. I just love Nintendo writing so much. Yeah, me too. Sweet treat. Oh yeah, sweet treat. What if? Sweet hey, Chad! Is that here? I'll show him that later. That'll make him really happy. What? Sweet treat. Does he... He just it? says that a lot. He doesn't know anything about Mario. Oh, this game. Yeah, he just... Everything's a sweet treat to him. Those crazy lights. Oh. Intrepid Koala says I was talking about Star Fox Assault. That does sound more right. Assault, that's what it was. Because that was the one that was more about, like, shooting... Like, being in the ship and mm -hmm. being in the tank and stuff. It was fun. I liked, I liked being slippy. Mysterious power was given to me. Ooh, yay. Hmm. 
You can see the sky now a little bit. It's a Actel mm. asks if we're gonna finish the whole game. Not I, today. Not today, but that's the plan to <laughs> eventually finish it. That'd be cool. I'm really excited to see you do the final, the boss battle. By my reckoning, Mario can now perform what is known as a special move. Yeah, wait, should I do this or would it be like a long tutorial? Uh, I wasn't reading. What did he say? He's gonna show me my special move. Mm, you can if you want. I mean, I'll just, do you just want learn it? it in combat. It's really not hard. You okay. throw stuff. Alright. I only use it when I'm really desperate and I don't have any items. It's not that helpful. It helps in a pinch, though, for sure. Petal Meadows! Someone said it, or actually it's Actel again, so okay, good, because this is a 30 hour game. <laughs> yeah, we would die. <laughs> Princess Peach? How did he. Anyways, <laughs> he just said a picture of her to me. We still don't know what happened to Peach, huh? No. Alright. Cool. Off to Petal Meadows. Yeah, Petal Meadows. We go. God, it sucks because I love every single partner in this game in a different way. But you can only have one at a time out? Yeah, but like... It's tough because when I play through it, like especially towards the end, you have the option of having one partner out at once, obviously, but when you talk to people, sometimes your partner will talk for you, and by that I mean you don't talk, so your partner talks for you. Oh, so there's like extra So it changes dialogue. the dialogue, yeah. It's almost like Mass Effect in that way. I never played Mass Effect. Oh, My dude. boss says I need to. Who does? Your boss does? Yeah, she loves Mass Effect. Cool. Well, we're about to head to Petalburg. Uh, before we do that, we're going to take a real quick break. Uh, but yeah, we'll be back in a second. So, bye. Have you seen bye. my BRB thing yet? No. Oh, it's so cute. It's like Waluigi. I'm so glad you recognized it. Yeah. Right, awesome.
Okay. Okay. There we go. We're back. Hello. Sorry, I was just tweaking that uh, that new background image that we have, it's which uh, came courtesy of. Let me find the. I had it open and then I closed the tab. Yeah. I'm bad at this. Eric Burnett on Twitter. So Shway from V on Twitter is his name. Uh, created this little background for us, which is real, real nice. I know. It's cute. I like it a lot. I like it too. Uh, we've also got the Twitch chat on this monitor, this secondary monitor now. So we will hopefully be a bit more attentive. Um, but yeah, we can hop right back into the game now, which is very Yay. exciting. Hooray! Where's the GameCube controller? Here we go. There you go. Fun. All right, let's Matt hop back says, into it. Did you win yet? I don't think we won yet, Matt. <laughs> I don't think we beat the Mario yet. All right, so we're going to Pedal, Pedalton, Pedalberg. What is Pedalberg. it? Pedalberg. I think yeah, it's Pedalberg. That elf Mario has beef. Yes, this is. I still use this like towards the end of the game. I use that. It's good out there. Take this with you. Badges were in the first game too, right? Because I remember getting mm. a bunch of them in the yeah. one. This badge is, in particular, is like, I, th I don't know, it's my favorite badge because it's really cheap to use it. I think it's only like a one point badge. Alrighty. Rayosin says you're 100% Japanese. What? Yep, that's me. Yep. Alright, let's equip this. I was just confirming. Q FP required. God, it's such a so cheap I, badge. It's such a good badge. I use two flower points. Mm -hmm. Let's we whack an enemy with great power. So it just does hella damage, basically? Yeah. Let's fight this dude. Yes! I'm excited. Taking on the robos. Let's get and this the party. robos. I guess robos makes more sense. Because they're robbers? Yeah. I think you might be right. Say two people are watching? That's, see, those are your audience members. That's how many people are watching on Twitch, right? Yes. Yeah, we got two viewers. Mm -hmm. One of them is trying to throw a can at you. Rude. They really don't like you. It takes a little longer to charge that one. Next time I'm gonna wear a Goombella hat. That just seems like a good idea. Oh, did the tip of his spear hurt me? Yeah, it did. Eek. Aw, look how sad she looks. I gotta do something. Oh, I could just kill this dude. Yeah, just kill him. How many? Yeah. Two, one, boom. Ah! You didn't time it. I right. whiffed it. Let's see how likely we are to kill this dude. 20 HP. <laughs> At least yet now you get to see how much health he has. A workaholic. <laughs> Do you have no chance of beating him? Yeah, you don't. You can't beat him yet. You gotta go. Tactics, yeah. Oh, it lets you on Yeah, the free escape. <laughs> I think he just straight up says. <laughs> Triple helping of that humble pie. Well, let's go to the inn real quick and heal up. It's not a bad idea. Who stole all my money? That, um, that bandit. Okay. But you still have a little bit of money. Did he like? Yeah, uh, Zyzex Remix just said he's easier with the next partner you get, and he's absolutely right because yeah. the next partner is amazing. Don't tell me. I'm not saying. I'm just saying they're amazing. Every partner is great. Like there's nobody. This place open yet? Yeah. Is this a bad store? Mm-hmm. Makes action is easy but earn less star power. These are really expensive badges. Mm. The problem with badges that are expensive is, um... Oh, it only costs 1 BP? What? 
badge power, you have to upgrade a lot more before you start trying to use it. Can I get this one? Just because I've been screwing up the timing on my jumps so badly? Not yet. No? No. Right. I wouldn't get it yet. Okay. We may come back later. Actually, wait. Before we go, I want to talk to these people and learn about them real quick. She's got a heart tail. Mm-hmm. The lovely house of matches. <laughs> Squadron 10 said Super Paper Mario was so disappointing compared to this game, and I have to wholeheartedly agree. Yeah, I, it's funny. The, something that the chat said over and over, and it's something that you've told me privately, is that uh, there are only really two Paper Mario games. Yeah. It's this one and the original one. I, I tried really hard. I was so excited for Super Paper Mario, and it just didn't have any of the charm. It didn't have any of the appeal of the this combat system. It's sad. It was really, really sad. The only good thing about Super Paper Mario was Luigi. How tight would it have been if Sticker Star was good? Wouldn't that have been great? That would have been awesome. What a nice treat that would have been. Alright, we haven't been over here yet. Look at this fool. Um, I want to know what she is. Like what creature? Yeah. Wait, what, what's it, what are they offering? Trade my badges for any star pieces you have. What you got? Right now she just has sound effects available to you because you only have like what one piece? Yeah. It's free though. It's, yeah. I forgot about the sound effects badges being free. Should we do it? Yeah, let's do it. Well, okay, yeah. Let's hear some funny noises. All right. Okay, try it. Hmm. That's a cool noise. Will his jumps sound different? No. How bad? I have visited her so many times when I was younger. I couldn't figure out what to do. Her lovely? Yeah. She's basically like what you can do now with Google. <laughs> it's like a hint system. Okay. Probably my next path. I like that there are hearts in the dialogue. She's so... Cabra de Abra. Hobaloo. Bakapuka Peekaboo. Stars. This is so occult. Mm -hmm. Oh no. The sound design is so great. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh she's back. It's been so long since I needed her. Go to the right, turn into a plane, and fly right. Strange white hand beckons you. You attack without delay, then the way opens. Tight. I like Sounds how she good. always says, then the way opens. Someone is giving the advice of, like someone uh, in the chat was looking for advice on how to play Paramore. They're like, you should play Sticker Star first and then treat yourself to the good ones later. <laughs> That's great. It's all uphill from there. That's a good idea. All right, here we go. God, that curse is just the worst. It's so horrible. Uh oh. There's a strange white hand beckoning. Gotcha. Yay. I'm gonna fight this blooper. Fighting this big old blooper. Oh man. I like that he's coming down from the roof. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of with him on this. We were definitely the aggressors in this. Whatever. I got some serious moxie. Some saucy mustache. If I could describe yeah. Mario in one word, it would be saucy. <laughs> He's so saucy. <coughs> He's saucy like a spicy meatball. Tomato saucy. The old tentacle trample. <coughs> Alright. So, what was the uh, new ability that I learned? Sweet treat. Yeah, okay. you don't need it yet. Because that you're at full power. It's really just to power you up when you're dying. There you go. We did it. That one's easier, I think, than the jump one, because it's like, 
there's a very clear, uh, like, audio prompt. Yeah. There's, like, a clear sonic prompt. It is easier than jumping. Nice. Camilla really doesn't like this blooper, and I don't really understand why. She just doesn't like slimy things, I guess. Nasty. Icky. I love the way that text is moving. Yeah. She really doesn't like it. It, it well, really gives you the creepy crawly. Yeah. Damage both the tentacles, it'll fall down, then it's attack time. So she gives really good advice on how to fight it. I wasn't thinking that, dog. I was not thinking that you'd taste good. You want to snack on these tentacles. Darn bloopin! <laughs> Ow. <laughs> he slapped you. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna do an... Oh, I can't? I had to jump on it? Yeah, he's in the air. This is... There you go. And then one hit from her will do the job. Then it's attack, attack time. time. <laughs> Even the shy guys in the crowd are getting pumped. Alright, let's wail on him. The, all three of them. Or, we're not gonna wail on him. We're gonna squid on him. Get it? He's not a whale. He's like a different sea animal. Thanks. You're welcome. Uh-oh. Could I... Do I get FP back for a uh, sweet treat? Yeah, you do. Where's SP? Oh, it's the star meter. Okay, yeah. that's new. That was not in the original Paper Mario. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you just... Oh, I should have definitely told you how to do it. That's alright. <laughs> Get some health for Goombella. Watch out for the... the... poisonous sections, though. I'm like a pro... Smash 4 player. Watch out. <laughs> I, only, I only hit one. I'm okay with it. And it was at the end. That was the easiest little... Like, the sweet treat I've ever seen. Like, you got so many points out of that. What the hell? Maybe it's easier the first time. Oh. I need to start actually paying attention to the chat. I'm sorry. Uh, Zavrox says, how far into this game is this? Seems to be fairly early on. Yeah, this is literally just... We haven't even left Rogue Port yet. Yeah, we're in the first area. It's almost dead. Oh, he's almost gone. Oh, jerk. You really... It's attack. It's not attack time again. God, you were so close. Actually, you can just jump on his head. Really? I mean, I don't see why not. Oh, you guys can't. Never mind. I think you have to, like... I'm all the wrong. I assumed because the HP meter was up for his head. Would this work? I wonder if this would hit him directly. Oh, it will! It's a cute Fireflower Sprite. It is. Got him. Slager says, I gotta head out for a bit, but I don't want to leave this stream. How long is this gonna go on? Uh, I don't know, but as, as long as we feel like, basically. Yeah. But uh, the I archive will be on YouTube, so if you want to watch it later, you'll be able to watch it there. People talking about how hot Goombella is. She is. Can't argue with that. Nope. Oh, she, how dead Goombella is. She drowned <laughs> as hell. Matt just tweeted something. Chapter one. Oh my god, that's amazing. Huh. I didn't notice in the chat somebody says she white or Asian <laughs> about me. <laughs> Matt tweeted the comments. None of the above. Castle and Dragon. It's my favorite iPhone game. Sam is like, I can't believe Gumbella is dead. <laughs> can't believe Gumbella is fucking dead. Bad end. Wow, this looks like the area from Paper Mario 1. Start our adventure. I'm excited. I like I like the pedal brick feels. Ooh. 
Shadow. A what? A dragon. Mm-hmm. Intrigue. I actually know what Rayo-san is talking about, about Vivian, and I'll talk about it later when we actually talk to Vivian. Yeah, like we're she, trying to... When she's in-game. Um, but yeah, that is, that is... We'll talk about that later. Alright. Andrea's being very kind and keeping this pretty spoiler-free for me, which I appreciate. I don't want to tell you what you're going to see later anyway. Yeah. Just ran away from the Goomba. Excellent. So Lord Revan says it'd be lovely if they ported this and the original game to the 3DS. I agree. That'd be real nice. Give us a real Paper Mario. Is that a badge? Yes. Sick. Close call is super handy. Is there a, just a chance to get that, or do you always get that right there? You know, actually, I don't know. I think I like the original Paper Mario battle music a little bit more than this. This grows on you. It's just nostalgia, I think. Nope. Got a hammer him. The, uh, the spiked Goombas are a really good way of, like, it's early enough in the game that they want everything to be easy, but they still want you to have some amount of tactics you can give. Mm. Could have appealed. What does that do? You get star power from your audience. Your bell does it. Actually, I hope you don't kill him. You're gonna kill him. I wanted to see Goombella's appeal animation. It's really, really... Fart points. Yep. FP stands for the FP. It stands for Fraser Park. Mm -hmm. Greatest movie ever made. Have you seen the FP? At no. least one person in the chat, I bet, has seen the FP. Mm -mm. We'll see. If... Ah! You better run, nerd. That's right. Ah! <laughs> Got him. <coughs> oh, wow. They're protecting some sweet items, though. God, there's a hole in my tights. God, I don't have to take public transit today, and that's just awesome. Oh yeah, driving. Oh, we still didn't get to see your animation. God. We'll do it. We'll do it next battle. I know, I keep forgetting to say anything about it. Nice. We gotta get this money. God. Oh, am I supposed to hit it, like, is there only a set amount of time and I have to get as much out of it before I... No, it's only, I think, like, three hits on that. Right. Look at that badge. Rude. Don't they have a buddy who can grab that later, though? Gimme says, imagine origami, origami Paper Mario. That, I mean, that's what it, we kind of do when you get the powers. Oh, right, yeah, with the boats and the airplane and stuff. <laughs> It would be cute to have like an origami style, I suppose. She's telling me about the block. That's interesting. Tell me about this pipe. Oh, she won't. This music's pretty great. Am I backtracking? Yeah, I was actually thinking the same thing. Fennekin said paper Okami Mario or something. I was I was kind of alluding to that. Alrighty. There's something secret behind that thing. Oh, you saw it. Wow, she oh. talked about the river. He sees me, but he can't do anything. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow, you found that an accident. I had to press A on it. <laughs> I feel like Nintendo does this trick a lot. Someone, uh, or Gumi said Claymation Mario would be pretty sweet too. Clay Fighters. <laughs> Ew. Did we talk about Clay Fighters last week? 
Was it with you? Uh, yeah. I was talking to someone about it really recently. I don't think it was... I, I, don't, I know I talked about it recently, but I don't think it was with you, but I, nobody talks about Blade Fighters, so maybe it was me. We were talking about 63 and a third and stuff. Maybe that okay, was Okay, then that wasn't me. I'm just gonna keep going. I liked to be the spooky one. I forget his name. I was also talking about Primal Rage recently with someone. I feel like this was us. In the WarriorWare stream, maybe. Oh, maybe. Oh, Super Paper Epic Yarn. That'd be really cute. They, yeah, eventually they need to com combine all the arts and crafts <laughs> games into one. Samuel and said Clay Fighters U featuring Dante from Devil May Cry and Knuckles. And Knuckles. <laughs> I really like that little sticker. And fe now featuring Dante from the Devil May Cry series. Yep. What was that originally on, that sticker? I looked it up once. I figured it out. Oh, man. I don't remember. We made it to Pedalburg, dude. There it is. Aw. Leah says I'm her fave V. Cool. <laughs> Is your shirt? Yeah. When I got my license photo, the guy taking my photo said I looked like a bee too. Like, no one gets me. <laughs> my favorite character. V. <laughs> I'm the V, like Strong Bad. Bye, Sam. Sam went to the airport. Bye, Sam. Wow. Green boots. <laughs> Calling them out. Bella doesn't really like anyone's fashion sense. No, she's putting everyone on blast. I think I have a spiritual connection with Gumbella as a person. <laughs> she's old. Really old. <laughs> God, there is a really... I'm not going to say anything about it, but you definitely need to explore Petalburg because there is a character I really want to talk about that lives here. Oh, Skimmer Lover says, where did you two meet? How long have we known each other? I met Nick at an anime convention. At like a out. McDonald's, basically. That, we met, yeah, we talked at We McDonald's. basically met at McDonald's. It was pretty recently. That's disgusting you're running for mayor. <laughs> She's very, like, she is you. Yeah. Is, there, is that a DS light on the door of this building? Where? Right there. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know if that was intentional. How are, how are we on stats, actually? Let's see. Oh, you don't have any five points. Yeah, let's do it. I need the FP. <laughs> McDonald's. Yeah. Met at Wook Donald's. I'd like to say that we met at Wook Donald's. Have you seen The Devil's a Part-Timer? Yes, I did. Okay, I've seen like two episodes of it, and I really liked it. <laughs> I liked it at first a lot. I did not like where it went. I thought it was gonna stay really funny, but I don't know. Episode you ever one was super it? funny. No, I know. Episode one was amazing. Look at that dude. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Great. Oh my god! All these <laughs> fucking. There's so many. There are more good characters <laughs> in like one screen of this game than in like all of every recent Mario game. Oh man, I'm so excited. Like. General White here has more personality than all of the new Super Mario Brothers games combined. I know, right? <laughs> this guy is so dreary. It's like an al albino bomb. Uh, wow. Where do you what do you do first when you? Oh, that's a little baby! Oh my god. I have not seen that. Oh yes, I have. Wait, like, look at what he just said. Game Boy Advance games. Like what? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's funny because Intelligent Systems made this. I want Chad to see this. It's so cute. Apple Power says Hataraku is okayish. Um, the Japanese name for was a Hataraku Maosama, and I liked the direction it was going at first. I thought it was really funny. I don't want to spoil it for people who haven't seen it. Are you still it, talking about Devil's Apartment? Yeah. Okay. Not that I, can it, I just thought that it went in a direction that got really tropey and not funny anymore. I just texted Chad. I want him to see that, that baby toad. He's going to freak out. It's an adorable toad. Oh, he looks great too! I know. Is that you or who? That was me. Cute, so when... What's my iPad? That's what's yeah, doing. Yeah, I was about it. to be like, what? Be quiet. 
I know, actually, yeah, same thing. Yeah, they introduced a lot of characters, and it was just... Oh, yay! I'm retweeting this. Need to hear it again? No, I got it. It's a loyalty system. I, I want to add featuring Dante from the Devil May Cry series, just like as a... Like, for me. It, it was from a Shin Megami Tensei game, because I see the little... How block anyone? Courage Shell, Mr. Softener. <coughs> so, oh, cool. This lowly system is pretty rad. Get some jam and jelly later. I want to learn about him. Nif T. <laughs> <laughs> I love that T always stands for Toad. Oh my God, does it? Yeah. <laughs> The air is so clean. Nibbles will get you. If I fall in the river, then Nibbles will get me. Oh, isn't it Nibbles? <laughs> That's what she says. Every game should have or ten Kyle or Tay Kyle five K says every game should have featuring Dante on the cover. Agreed. That'd be pretty great. What if Dante was in this game? Look at Nibbles. Nibbles. <laughs> I like Nibbles because his name is really straightforward. Yeah. He is what he does. You know where he gets his name from. Bubulber. So he's like a bob -omb plant. Bubulber. He doesn't look that psyched. Hey! I want to show you something. Yeah. We're uh, streaming a little bit of uh, Paper Mario here. And there's just really cute toads everywhere. Oh my god. But I want you to see... <laughs> well, there's a couple I want you to see. First, I want you to meet the shopkeeper. <laughs> oh my god. He's ethnic. Like he's, got a, he's got a mustache, and... He's a wise. He is wise. He's got a calculator. His name's Nifty. Niftoad. Oh my god. Nifty stands for toad, she points out. Uh, but then also... There's a chef named Zesty. Zest? <laughs> I know. And then, uh... Azrael says, hey, Nick's roommate. His name's Chad. But, uh, but look at this little baby toad. <laughs> oh, fuck. That was, that was my reaction. <laughs> He says uh, he's really hooked on playing GBA games lately. What is GBA? Like Game Boy Advance. Oh, okay, okay. Fire Emblem. The rocks What's with the, uh... <laughs> oh my god, what is that dude? <laughs> like, what What creature is he? What species? Yeah, oh, go talk like, to him. What, it's great. What's his... Mm... Oh, he's got a French accent. <laughs> I was not... French-ass dude. He doesn't look super... He doesn't read very French to me. No, he looks like Disco Stu from The Simpsons. <laughs> Yeah. That's yeah, like what. That's the vibe I get. His sunglasses and afro for sure. Show Jimmy me the sh show me the chef toad. Oh, she's, oh, she's all the way back. She's like in another realm. She's I can Google it for you. She just called. Yeah, me down. Call me we'll Bozo the Dork. Like. She's really cute. Oh, they're all so cute. I know. Have you seen Gumbella though? No. Oh yeah. So Gumbella is my partner. Oh. This, this dude's like hitting on her. She's a. Is there a way to like? Here we go. I like her ponytail. She's got a ponytail. She's, she's got a little medicine. sharp tooth. She's an archaeologist. She's a smart, if sassy Goomba girl. Goomba. She wants to be an archaeologist one day. I can press X and she'll tell me about anyone. So, like, if I want to learn more about this baby toad. You just, like, what is this thing? This kid sure is a fanatic. All he talks about is video games. Zesty. <gasps> All right. Yeah. I'm Zesty. Zesty. I mean, this is like a parody photo. It's a parody her. where she. Is in Smash. For some reason, but. I wonder if he's finished his homework for today. Homework's important too. Look at this little uh, <coughs> albino bob -omb too. Look at him. Oh, whoa, rare. Yeah. With the stash. General White. General White? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't like that. That's a scary, that's a slightly clanny name to you have. You get to learn more about him later, and he's like, he's cool. I like him. Don't talk smack, but General White. He's just a regular ass toad. That's a toad from Petalburg. Uh, Takayle says she's a strong, independent Goomba who don't need no man. True. She like. don't need no man. She don't. I like she how... support herself. I mean, she, she immediately, her, like, runs to you because she, she started her own money. money. Right, the first thing that happens in the game is her not being Who's independent. Um, Aspirin? Or ibuprofen? Yeah, you want some? Yes. <laughs> I like how, uh, Goombella, like, you'll talk to someone and they'll be like, hey, there's this dragon called Hooktail, and then you'll ask Goombella about him, and she'll be like, it seems like he's obsessed with Hooktail. Like, <laughs> it's not that he's obsessed, he just has one line of dialogue. Oh, like, yeah, no one wrote enough, like, lines for him. I need, like, I want to hack the game and play as this baby toad, though. I mean, that's actually the cutest thing I've ever seen. All you have to do to make so a toad cute, cute is 
keep its mouth the same size, shrink its torso, make its eyes bigger. Yeah, that's a really cute oh little baby toe. God. Little arms. He's wearing a whole shirt. Um, Ed Skaden says, oh, you're going to love him so much later, and I'm hoping he's referring to General White, because I, I think love so. General White. It seems like it. General yeah. White. General White's a terrible that's name, awesome. though. No, he's cool. He's cool. What do you think of this guy? Like him. <laughs> it looks like, you know, like someone from like something out of like the Beatles like Yellow Submarine. Yeah. <laughs> he looks like if Olimar was a plant. Kind yeah. Of. It was kind of if, like, if Olimar like, oh, yeah, yeah, rejected yeah, yeah, Pikmin does. character. If Olimar and his Pikmin had a kid, it would be this. Yeah, like mutated yeah, yeah, incest. Yeah. And I feel like it might be a little bit cuter. It's I don't think it's incest for Olimar to, to have sex with Pikmin. It's fucked up, but it's not. I don't think incest is the word. No, I think, like, if the Pikmin were, like, having a lot of sex with each other, and then that, you know, that. Does Pikmin the color of the Pikmin matter? Olimar. So, like, w so two purple Pikmin would be messed up. What about yeah. a red and a purple and then that, And then that child of the purple Pikmin had sex with Olimar. What color would the purple Pikmin of a, of a double purple Pikmin be? Would I, be think, another purple I think Pikmin? it's kind of like, uh,. It's kind of like a bad batch of Sour Patch. You just never know. It could be it's, every time. It's gonna be someone different. That's true. I like Maybe that it'd idea. be like a really powerful. Who's she? Oh, that's Koopy Koo. Okay, Hello there, Koopy Koo. <laughs> Andrea has every character in this game his name memorized. It's, it's amazing. It's <laughs> a lot of. That's adorable, bro. I love that. Hello, Koopy Koo. <laughs> He's like. <laughs> Uh, Lord Ravana says Pikmin Orgy coming soon to Nintendo Wii U. I think it's Lord Revan. It's Lord a, Revan? It's a, oh, you're right. I only know that because I had friends who were obsessed with uh, Knights of the Old Republic in, in high school. First time watching this and they talk about incest. Yep. That was just now, too. It hasn't come up. Can I, I feel like Paper Mario could fit through this. <laughs> right? I mean... Maybe later. You know, yeah. Maybe later. There's a power called Super Paper Mario that just lets me turn sideways. Oh, here's the mayor, right? Because yep. he's old as fuck. Yeah, how did you know? <laughs> That's Croup. I actually like learning about someone before I talk to them, I think. Yeah, <laughs> I guess their dialogue makes more sense afterwards. Is he really seen out, or is he just working that angle? You know. <laughs> <clears throat> are you going to do the voice? Are you going to voice Croup? I'm too, like, borderline sick right now to do an old man voice that's not going to hurt. I get you. Maybe if they ever do follow through with that Paper Mario anime we were talking about mm -hmm. earlier, then you can then be the voice of group. Yes. I'll be better by then. Wow. <laughs> There's no way he can see. <laughs> you idiot? He called us idiots. Yeah. I'm gonna put these blankets over my feet. That's what I'm doing. I'm also doing that now. I may have heard the name, Hooktail. Brutal flyby snackings. <laughs> I'm glad I chose that, because I wanted to see that line of dialogue. Okay, I'm pulling it all the way up now, too. Yeah. God, it's cold. I'm on the blanket. Are you reckless fools? I mean, are you gallant heroes off to rough it up? What would you say? Mmm. I'd say, hold on now. Whoa there. This does sound <laughs> promising. And rewards. I didn't say that. I think he <laughs> is playing the old dude angle. That I'm a good egg. Murphy. Yep. <laughs> Super Paper Murphy. <laughs> Really, I love something Nintendo's really great about giving you meaningful choices in these games. <laughs> it's a lot like uh, the Monkey Island choices are also like really funny. I know it's not Nintendo, but yeah, no, there are. It's it's reminiscent a little bit. I think the dialogue, anyway. I think one of these is more polite, though, right? It's Mario is more polite than the name's Mario. Yeah, it doesn't matter either way. He says the same thing. They are nice eyebrows. Wow, and I'm glad he. Is, Go ahead. Oh, just, I like that he agrees that those are nice eyebrows. No <laughs> modesty. like, I agree, they are great. <laughs> I do have great eyebrows. Someone was calling out Waluigi. They said that Waluigi... He said, can I just jump in real quick and explain Waluigi's inferiority? Mm -mm. 
six hundred second timeout for even trying. <laughs> Schwonk Fortress? Are those like stealthy thwomps? Mm, Schwonks are really. There is a schwonk that you will encounter. This game has great sounding footsteps. Hmm. I like that little baby. Is that Wario? Yes, it is. Oh, Mario. wow. Wait, whose icon is that? What chat is that from? That's really cool. And how'd they get away with it? Hm. I thought there was like a no copywritten things for the icons rule. I got Mark says, I guess maybe Ted would, said, would say that Waluigi rocks his socks. I just liked that. I love that baby toad. Anyway, I got an email? I didn't even know I was capable of receiving email. I didn't know that email existed in the Mario universe, but I got one. Oh yeah, you have an S your Game Boy SP. Oh, is my, like your <laughs> my mailbox SP. Yeah. Alright. It's not an important email. I mean, you could read it. Just so you know how your gear works. I just wanted to see. My mailbox SP does not look like a good oh. device for email. Wow! Wait, are those from like. Holy shit. Oh, I've seen that. I've seen. I've seen the. Uh, what? Whose chat is that from, though? I'm surprised they got away with those. In e form. That's. <laughs> how I start all my emails. I like how he attaches a photo of himself, and just in case he forgot what I look like. He himself digging me. through the trash. <laughs> it looks like the map is in the trash. <coughs> Mr. Frankly referred us to the Rogueport Restoration Everyone's Committee. screaming Witwicks. Wow, I'm gonna get some Sweet emotes. I need a Waluigi emote real bad. <laughs> I do. What's up? All right, we talked to the mayor. We're allowed to go through. Oh, there he is. I like this hoodie. He's so cute. That he wears under his shell. But then, what attaches the shell? Like, never mind. <laughs> Coops. Coops Hagen Das. He's a favor. Well, if three dots means scram, this dude just told us to fuck off. According to this game's language. That dude at the bar? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, he did just tell you to fuck off a lot of times. <laughs> For sure, that's definitely what he meant. Barely. That was pretty good. It's like a game of joust. Oh, look at that cool looking dude. Oh, yeah. I want these. I'm glad you automatically knew to jump on a Koopa. It just felt right. It's the rule. The... Actually, I want to learn about him, though. I want to learn how he got so cool. I love Mario's, like, just got hit animation. It's too great. Didn't get it. Well, I hope the bingo happens in a second. Oh, well, no. I don't know if you saw, but that little, like, pop on the stage just yeah, fell down. Yeah, shimmering. Yeah, that'll happen, and it'll fall while you're fighting. And if you hit A, Whoa. You, can, you can dodge from it. Yeah, they're fast.
Yeah, the defense is so high. Oh, right. Oh, that, well, that normally would have dealt one damage, right? No! If it's a good item? Yeah. Wait, what? He was throwing a good item at you. Uh huh. So if it's a good item and you, like, hit them, then every, all the audience are like, oh, it's messed up, and they leave. Wait, but then, if, but I did get the item? No, because you hit him, so you didn't get it. He throws it at you. Wow, so that's a pretty new mechanic, too, mm -hmm. to me. Yeah. Sock Ben says, Nick hit him for throwing a good item, dang son. <laughs> now you've upset the fictional audience and the actual audience. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. About to level though, in a minute. Also, if you check the shrubs and stuff. Oh right, yeah. Press A on them. Yeah. Let's get some shits. Nothing so far. It's a good habit to be in, though. Yeah. <sighs> oh. I was not on purpose. I was trying to jump over the box and get away. <coughs> Actually, I'm glad. Go oh jeez. I gotta hit this properly. Yay, right. you got a coin. <laughs> Tip the old Mario cap. And a power block! Awesome. Oh. Should I go to the inn? Uh oh. I gotta go. I'm like scared. Here, let me... Yeah, you should probably... Also, people are mentioning that you can also hammer trees. For items. Oh, right. I did that like to the first tree I saw and then forgot to do it ever again. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Got him. I'm gonna stub my toe on this. Does this have high defense? I would. Here, let's learn about yeah, it first. Yeah, I, I would pedal. Hey, Luigi's watching. Mm -hmm. So this is in the audience. Flash. He does. Have, do you think that's a swarthy-looking face? Mm. Maybe it's the the strong like butt chin. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Wow. Kimbella's really cool. <laughs> Put him on blast. <laughs> These guys are rock solid. Fire didn't even hurt it. <laughs> hey, I have one of those. Thanks, girl. Wow. What are the odds? Mm -hmm. What do you think of that, Luigi? Luigi probably thought I was lazy. Well, fuck Luigi. He is there by himself. Luigi was alone. <laughs> Ow! Snug up on me. Was, what was the thing that you said that you use like when you're out of items? Oh, sweet treat, right? Oh, yeah, I only use that when I really like, have no good choice. After power says, phew, I still match Gabella's taste. Same. So far I do, yeah. <laughs> If I get the timing of that right, could she knock him down and then... No, I don't think so. And then hurt him? Mm-mm. Okay. Mm 
Yeah, the whole like hammer and jumping system totally exists in the Mario and Luigi games, by the way. That's so cool. I need to play those. I'm really good at blocking, but the jumping is gonna haunt me. Oh, I'm not shutting down the ball community. I'm just saying I'm glad that I'm still also in Gumbella's spectrum. Boom. Matt Lax wants me to play, uh... Ratchet and Clank? Ratchet and Clank, yeah. You should. Ratchet and Clank's really fun. It's been a long time since I've done that. Oh, that was cute. That Koopa randomly turned around and looked at the camera for some reason. <laughs> Weird. In, like, the Mario and Luigi games, though, there's, like, eight categories to upgrade when you level. Really? Yeah. Alrighty. I want more health right now. Read, read, read the, like, descriptions, though. Badge points. Wow. <laughs> I talk about it all the time. Uh... I just think dying would suck, but far points are great, too. <laughs> But I also love badges, but I don't have enough yet. I'm gonna do this for now. Now you see that it helps. Anyway. Sockpen says front facing Mario is very unsettling in Pair Mario. Yeah, it's I like agree. Front facing Phineas. <laughs> Face and firm. Oh, everyone else said badge power. Always badge power. Once I have badges, I will start investing in badge power. So I love badges. I like badges. Oh. I'm a huge fan of flower power. This game is so cool, though, because it's like they really did successfully strip down an RPG to just the most bare things while still, like, being somewhat complex. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude! Wait, I feel like if I hit him and go into combat, it'll disappear. Yeah, I wouldn't. Urgh. The cool thing about him is that he seems to swoop, but, like, only on one plane. So if I get out of the way, if I just walk towards the camera, he can't get me. Yeah, that is what's nice. But... Oh, my mom's calling me. Oop. These things are scary. I'm gonna text her. I'm gonna... I feel like that might have been bad. He's got spikes. Yeah. Any spike is pretty much shorthand for don't jump on this dude. I'm gonna go answer it. Call me again. Gonna... Oh, I can't hammer him either. All right, I gotta figure this out okay. myself. Oh yeah. Come on. Tell me what's good, girl. Yeah. Defense is four. Oh, they're impervious to fire! I They just said that. <laughs> Fuck. Did you just waste the fire flower? I did, weird? yeah. Power block. <coughs> What's up with these... Are, are power block's really mandatory for all these, like, these mini-bosses? Mm -hmm. That was dumb. I just basically boo-fooed. Put it in Persona 4 Endurance Run Parlance. Alright, onward. You can't hit me down here though, right? No. Ugh! Oh. He's so fast. Oh, he's really, really fast. Oh, like free health, or f health for five coins. <laughs> it's I didn't mean nice to do that, but that's alright. I got money. I just wanted to see that pop up again. What's up? Slightly different dialogue. Right. Whenever you walk into an area in an RPG and the music just stops, you know some shit's about to go down. Look at this thwomp. That's a schwonk. Oh, 
I just want to see what he says if I says no. He just called me a coward. <laughs> <laughs> now you want to try? This is going to be really fun. Wow, that's a great... <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Super fun quirk quiz. Let's see, I'm going to not help you with these. Thanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cruel and unusual punishment. There you go. Off to a good start. Much harder. Oh, shit. Okay, it's not 12 or 16. That's a weird number. Unless it is. It's 20 or 16? Uh, I actually don't remember. Which is 20 seems too much for a disposable item. Is this softener? Does he say that every time? Yeah. Oh. Whoa. What'd you guess? I just... So he only says, is that your real answer if it's wrong? So I can kind of cheese it, I just discovered. <laughs> Group. Yep. Yeah. No. I meant to say Petalburg. Just kidding. <laughs> it's actually Rogueport. Uh, the first crystal star? Wait, so he didn't ask me if that was my final answer for that one, though. Oh, okay. Wait, weird. How did you get here? Sorry, I'm just I'm trying to figure out like the underlying system of how to cheat this. How can we get from Petal Meadows to Rogueport? Uh, you... Don't race in a cart. I don't think I took a pipe. What did I take a pipe? I took a pipe. <laughs> I'm trying to remember if maybe I turned into an airplane or something. <laughs> no. Oh, these are gonna be tough, apparently. <laughs> what the fuck? Goombas don't. Fuzzies don't. <coughs> clefs. Wait, clefs kind of do. I think clefs might. <laughs> fuck. I'm a blithering meathead. <laughs> oh, jeez. Final Plus question. Plus, the things that Gabella said were, um, she used a weird word to describe them. They're just a rock head and feet. It's a, there's a flashing seven right behind me, so I think this is question number seven. <laughs> Are you sure? Is that your real answer? I actually thought it was, like, maybe a trick. <laughs> he loves to spin. He doesn't really have much, many parts of his body that can move, so that's why. <laughs> Damn, I get... really like that this is what you get instead of a boss battle. Yeah. Some brain pain. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> it surprisingly is. Alrighty. Another boss battle down. I mean, sub boss. Alrighty. Do you want to take a quick break, real quick? It's up to you. Let's see. Let's, we've been going for about another hour. Oh, multi bounce. Sick. Alright, that seems like a good place. Stop for a second. Uh, Super Question 64 sounds like the best game ever. It's what Zabor has said. That was <laughs> one of the things. Alrighty. Well, we'll be right back in a second. Mostly just because I have to pee. But, yeah. <laughs> see you in a second. Let me.
I did it. I brought us back. Oh, okay. I have a full bottle of water, and I'm ready for more Mario. <laughs> Where's that GameCube at? There it goes. Alrighty. I'm a level two Mario. <laughs> oh, wait, let me... <coughs> cool. I'm talking. Ah, fuzzies. I'm not a huge fan of fuzzies. Is this area, like, chugging a little bit? Yeah, it is. Maybe it's the water animation slowing it down. Maybe. It seems fine when I'm up here. Ah! Yeah, I hate them. <coughs> They're very unpredictable. Is that good? Mm-hmm. What'll that do? Confuses them. They already seem pretty confused. Well, let's learn about them. Good idea. Wait, sorry, it's technically an attack. Yeah, is it? Oh shit, I was looking at my phone! I, was, I remember thinking that that was the one thing that seemed- Can I do the appeal thing? You can do it with Mario, but it's not as cute. Alright, I'll, I'll wait for her then. Oh no, he is sapping her health away. Can I can I guard against that? You can, the timing's just weird. It's right before it pops off of you. That's right after. Alrighty. It's a fuzzy. What a hyper little guy. Cup back on the caffeine. Caffeine exists in the Mario universe. That's a that's also news to me. It's a lot of stuff at randomly. Yes, cucumbella hype. The moment they release you. Got it. These things really suck. HP. I don't think you can say suck in a Mario game circa 2003. Actually, what year did this game come out? Uh, 2005, 2006? Oh, the level just fell down and hit everybody. Yeah, I told you. Remember when I said? Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy how that happens. 2004. We'll be taking bets. Will Nick tackle the golden fuzzy or not? Place your bets. Aw, oh, girl. I would also be down for a Goombella Romance Option DLC. I got this. Wait, should I have her appeal? Just to see it? That's great. Sabine says keep a close eye in chat. He's going AFK and so is Azrael. Alrighty. Got him. Ooh, right after you with the hammer, press A again for a stylish. Yeah, that's stylish points. Look at all these items. I was gonna see if you'd discover it on accident and be like, whoa, what was that? <laughs> yeah, it is about time you learn about stylish points. That's a cool way to illustrate the chance to escape. It ah! Is. Oh my god, am I just like siphoning. I'm hemorrhaging money <laughs> from my cowardice. New badge? Mm -hmm. Stone. Um. Now I'm forced to fight more. Got it. Not a fan of these guys. I want to like throw a, a flower, Koopa but... shell that, between them all. Do you want to throw a Koopa shell between them all? Is that a thing you can do at some point? I mean, I don't know. Look at the crowd we're building up, though. Yeah, I know. It's, it's funny how they, they start they start showing up. That was easy. Thanks, Fireflower. I know, I love having one of those. You already oh, got this man. Thing, though. Yeah, it looks like it is slowing it down. Low HP Bella is indeed sad. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, look at her. I know. She's kind of like Howdy. a Hegao Goombella. Oh. 
No. I wonder what that would look like. That you can see I don't right know. there. No, it's like she's like almost there. She's like too sleepy for that to she's be. She's like sleepy, Ahago. Have I been over here yet? No, I think I came down the pipe and then didn't. He's got a little bat though. That looks neat. Oh yeah, it's a cool item. Oh, you know what? I should use that star power. Yes! Nice. I've locked it. Um, Slager Drake, I think I said that right, said that this area really lagged when he test emulated the game before. Um, not 100% sure if it's the water in close space or what. My guess is the water given the slowdown happens when you're in it. Not 100% sure though. Yeah, it seems fine when I'm like, or at least better when I'm out of it. I was able to block both of those, just kind of like cheese and A. Yeah, uh, it, and sometimes like, I think that's how I did it too. It's not really specific. Ooh. Oh, see? See? This is how sweet Oh, and then he's just like confused for a second, but it doesn't actually hurt me, right? No, it just confuses you. This is a cool little minigame. I like this. I like it too. Healing everybody. That's a useful as heck power. I like that. I think it's useful. I mean, it's, it's like when you're on your last legs. It's like... Yeah. It's way less useful when you have more HP and flower power and stuff. Got him. Yeah, we've got like kind of a bunch of viewers today. This is nice. This is cool. Got 151 people. Wow. How neat. That is I'm... lovely. I've never streamed before. You're. Well, sorta. We did. Oh, he's got we that did, back. Like, we did the Walu the Waluigi. We did the Warrior. Oh Wear. my god, dude! Waluigi Wear would be the best fucking game. <laughs> Waluigi Wear. I'm gonna try to escape from him over here. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> got the Moonstone. It's gonna evolve my Clefairy. <laughs> I was really sad when I was a kid because I had a moonstone and I thought I really, I really didn't want to have to make her a clefable because they, were, they weren't as cute. Clefables are not as cute. I mean, I feel like my mind has changed now. now that really? I'm no, I, I really like clefable, but clefairy's really cute. It's maybe one of the only like traditionally cute Pokemon that I like. What are some of the non-traditionally cute Pokemon that you like? Uh, Electivire is my favorite. Who? Electivire. Is that a little electric? Electivire's uh, evolution. Oh no, we got put to sleep. Yeah, you're sleeping. We're talking about Waluigi wear dating sim. Damn it. Can you still block it when you're sleepy? No. That's one of the problems about being sleepy. It really feels good though, like pulling back on the stick and then letting go. It's like so physical. I know. It's such a physical motion. It's like you're actually... Swing a little hammer. Yeah, smooch is the hardest time, or the hardest thing to time right for dodging. Whoa! What? <laughs> hey! Those little Japanese dick. boxes in the back. Yeah, there was Japanese on them. Yeah. I wonder what that said. I'm really getting tough is the way to go for oh. moonstones. Probably. Uh, I, I just I had a Clefairy. And I loved my Clefairy. Well, this is not an optional battle. Mm mm. Alright, well, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna get the timing that right, so I'm just gonna hammer. What? You're dizzy. Oh, so just, I touched the fuzzies and got dizzy, is what you're saying. I don't know how they got you dizzy. I think I touched the fuzzies. Ugh! The fuzzies suck. You're really horrible. It's gonna really suck if you die. I'm just gonna bust out a bunch of items. Oh yeah, you still have items. Um... 
Wait, what did they do again? The tax you should foes. probably be able to... Adzel is leaving, I think. Bye, Adzel. Ugh. Alright, good. Yeah, you're, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Alright. I like that she makes traditional Goomba walking noises when she moves. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Oh, the chitin and the pubes. I got it. it. I blocked it. Great handle. Cool. Oh man. <laughs> Look at the shine sprites in the corner. Yeah. Wait, what do they mean? If you had gone another round, you could have rolled to see if you had gotten like a bingo kind of thing. And then if you get bingo, then it would replenish you your health. If it's shine sprites, it's your health, flower power, and um, star power. Huh. So it does like everything. If you only can get flowers, it only replenishes FP. And shine sprites are the best ones, though. Yeah, and you don't want the the poisonous mushroom one because that halves everything. Ah. York. York. Okay, rude, golden fuzzy. Rude, rude. People were taking bets. He's gonna lunch on our head, dude. You can't flee the golden fuzzy. Is he confused? Who, Mario? No, I used the ruin powder on him. I'm supposed to confuse enemies. I don't think it worked. Look at that. It's very, very appealing. Yeah. Oh, we're so close. Holy shit! <laughs> I like the audience is fine. Yeah, they're chillin'. Wow! Right? This is very rude. Carol. We got this girl. And we're gonna use star power. I'm getting a little bit worried. <laughs> God, you are so much better at this than me. I'm awful at sweet treat. Uh, <laughs> how'd it go? That's a lot of health. That's really good. Yes, you're getting it. Yeah! Woo! <coughs> that felt good. It says here not to freak out. <laughs> Ringleader. I was having trouble reading that word. I was like, Ringle Adder. Alright. We can learn about. Th we know who the Ringleader is. Right. Hmm. So I should just jump on him. Do some precision. Nice precision.
Perfect. Mm -hmm. Took no damage. Secretly a little bit glad you struggle you struggle as much as I do with Is jumping. Timing? Just with jumping. I can't I still am not good at jumping timing. I don't know why. Oh no! I targeted the wrong thing. Jeez. I can't tell, the, the annoying thing about the jump is I can't tell if it's working or not. Like, will I always get two hits? Nimbella's dead. Oh, shit. Yeah, you will if you time it right. You always get two hits. No, she's good! She's alive as hell, dude. Wait, she what? Dang. Okay, cool. And she's gonna save the day right here. You go, Gumbella. Oh yeah, it's lagging again. I think it is the water. I do like the noises they make as they go. <laughs> Good spring mon, noises. Mon, mon. Something I haven't thought about in a while is that we have that badge that makes Mario's noises different. Oh yeah, and it's equipped. Woo! Pivanzi says, Nick, are you going to any cons this year? Uh, I haven't really decided yet. I'm definitely going to GDC. Maybe... The, maybe all the PAXs except for South. Uh, E3, too, probably. Uh, and, like, anime cons? IDK. Maybe Fanime? You should come to the ones I go to. Okay, deal. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. Did I do the thing? Can I leave? Yeah. You have the... This, you should... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. Alright, what's up? So my... How am I on my quest? Am I free to leave this area? Manzi says, come to PAX East. Come to SakuraCon. SakuraCon Ikimasu! Sakura happening at the same <laughs> Gurugamesh. Gurugamesh. Anime. And manga. Oh, someone's talking about Colossal Con. I what know, but Harmony really wants to go to that. It's like a water park con. Whoa. It's like it happens at the same place as a water park. It's really cool with all, the, with all the sports anime that are popular right now, I feel like that would actually be pretty great. Oh, I see. I see where you're getting at. Yeah, I guess. Whoa, he actually got up on this ledge. Did you see that? No, for I didn't. Like, for a second, he was like up here. Soccer Con is in Seattle. I'm not going to Soccer Con. Because... What are some of the other things in that commercial? Anime and manga. Garugamesh. <laughs> I just remember Garugamesh. DDR <laughs> is definitely one of them. God, it's been so long since I've seen that soccer icon commercial. I'm just going to play the audio from it in the background. Okay. Oh, someone actually brought it up. Oh, tight. I'm actually going to do something. Wow, it's got 1.7 million views. Mm -hmm. I love YouTube. D Grayman, yeah, DDR. D Grayman is one of them. Um, add. <laughs> I'm just adding it to the to the stream here. There it is. There we have it. I love sushi. I love Japan. Period. It's Easter. Sherrod. Yeah. Garugamesh. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. What did he say? Yeah. Smile DK. Yeah. Smile DK gets a name drop? Yeah. Don't just talk about it. Check out Sakura. Look at him, he's like holding up sushi. Check SakuraCon.org for all the details. God, it's so good every time. Holy shit. 
incredible. Oh, that poor chef. When he says, get your butts to SoccerCon, he's really saying, please get the fuck out of my sushi bar, you horrible assholes. He hates them all so much. I really hope they reimbursed him to be in that shitty fucking commercial. I do. He deserves better. Like, hey, this is a mafia of my culture. <laughs> it's really, what a horrible way to sum up Japan. <laughs> Anime, manga, DDR, J-Rock, Garugamesh, <laughs> Smile DK. <laughs> Okay, like the way she says it too. Yeah. And manga. <laughs> like, if you think DDR is an instrumental part of Japanese culture, you're a, a shitty person. <laughs> I love DDR more than anything, and I think that's a fucking horrible thing to say. When I think of Japan, I think of samurais and also DDR. <laughs> samurais. Samurais. Sushi bar. Bushido. Ugh. Shurikens. Like, fuck off. That was a good jump. Did you see that? Am I correct to be backtracking right now? Yeah. Okay. Right. I'm like nervous. Garugal Gilgamesh. It's a band. I wonder if people at SoccerCon still like make jokes about that commercial. Oh yeah, that's a good question. I know a lot of people going to SoccerCon. Yes, I don't know. It just for me as someone who's never been and who's only been to Seattle once, when I hear Sakura Khan, I immediately think Sakura Khan Ikimas. <laughs> I would go if planes weren't expensive. Like that's dumb. I'm just gonna dodge everybody. Did I him jump into the music? Yeah, it's good. You're really getting to, into the rhythm of this game. Like, when you're timing things, I saw you going... Oh, really? Yeah, you were like... It is rhythm heaven, basically. <laughs> I love Koopy Koo. I mean, she's no Goombella. Who is, really? N nobody. What's up here? I like doing... I think you can do, like, the backwards Mario jump from the 2D Mario game sometimes. I think this up is really far. <laughs> what is? Some, um, Lord Autumn Bottom said drive from SF. To Seattle? Yeah. No, I'm good. <laughs> That's so insane. <laughs> what kind of stuff is on the shelf in here? Two jars full of red balls, like red hot. We need to like. know what the stuff is, like the food. Like I'm I, gonna look that up while we eat burritos. There's a Mario week. wiki. Yeah. God, the mayor's house is so hideous. Has Mozilla like, commented on oh, it? Oh, she did. The first, okay. like, when you first walk into the town, someone's like, "You should go talk to our old ass mayor. He lives in a pink house." She's like, "That sounds horrible, but at least we'll be able to spot it." <laughs> she's like, God, I love her. She's so great. I know. <laughs> I don't like the way that older toad is smelling that baby toad's hair. It's <laughs> creeping me out. God, that baby toad is so cute. I gotta, I wanna, I wanna kind of escort him away. <laughs> oh, now he's on that N64 tip, though. Oh, that's the bigger one. Okay, what N64 games did intelligent systems develop, though? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he's right. Lady Bo is the cutest boo of all time. Besides maybe Pika and Lala, who you'll meet in the shops in Room Point. It's fucking me up a little bit that Paper Mario is a is a game in the Paper Mario universe. Oh, that's I didn't like think about that. it's not like Paper Mario to them though. It's just like it's like GTA or something, you know? It's mm. just like people talking about Lark and Seal, all the J Rocks. <laughs> Y'all remember that dude uh, Hide? Like, mm -mm. he hung himself in the bathroom. Dude, no. But, like, in a sex way, people think. Oh, dang, no. Yeah, it's a song called Dice. That's crazy. See, the thing is... But I guess just said Bo is a tsundere, and Bo is the ultimate tsundere, so... Great. She's got a fan, right? Yeah. That's awesome. She's so cute. This dude's pathetic, and it bums me out. <laughs> why would you say that about coops like that? Like, why are you gonna talk about coops? I mean, he did beg. Woo! <laughs> Look at Mario's reaction. <laughs> Is Mario's face, like, really surprised right now? Mario's tilted. He's, like, definitely stretched, kinda. Yeah, like, I don't know why. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, dude. 
Can I like shoot out his shell though as a thing? Is that a thing? I don't know. Mario needs to stop me in my face. <laughs> nope, sorry. I don't think so. <laughs> Gumbella's all for it. If Gumbella's down, then I'm down. It's not really optional. No. Alright, what can he do? Coop's ability is a primer. Press X to shoot. Yeah, he can! Yeah, I know. I just don't want to tell Wait, you. Oh, thank I you. I wanted to see. Maybe I did play. I still, like, can't remember if I played this game or not. And it's like, fuck with me. I have a horrible memory. Coop's is, like, probably... I, I usually bring Coops out when I'm like in a dire moment because he's really he has really good defense. Mm. You know how Gumbella usually like even if you block she'll still get like one point of damage. Yeah. Coops doesn't have that problem. Hmm. Alright, I get it. Wayne says, Mario is like, your dad is for sure dead. <laughs> God. That's what his face meant. That's what that scratch up face was like, oh, jeez. Your dad's hacking dead. Oh, is that his GF? Did you hear all that? Wow, well, Koopa Koop's pretty impressed. Is she, or is she like... No, she's worried, because she's like, him. you're gonna die, because you're not strong or good. Koopa honor systems are really weird. I always wonder how Bowser is the king of Koopas when... Like, I... I don't know, I just, I don't really understand necessarily, like, the hierarchy of Koopas. Yeah, it's not as clear as the Mushroom Kingdom. Wow! Right. She's, like, not even listening to her. She said she's down, dude. You don't have to do this stupid journey. He wants to do it for himself. Well, I like he told he told us that it's for himself and his dad, but then he told her it was for her, so he's kind of just changing his story depending on who he's trying to impress. I, I mean, I feel like you're reading a lot. I don't like this guy. It's you don't like hoops? <laughs> you're full of shit, Nick. <laughs> I'm so sad that you don't like hoops. I love hoops. I actually really like his design. I like a Koop, like a Koopa wearing a hoodie and looking sad is great. I like how his eyes just a little bit. He's a little injured looking. I hope he doesn't get uninjured over the course of the game, because he no. would not be recognizable by the end of the game if it weren't for that stupid eyelid. That would be cool. There we go. I like Koops' timing best. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. The game is a lot easier now that you have Koops. I'm glad. Because I, I knew there was some sort of ability about a shell. Someone in the chat, could you please let me know if, like, if it's totally possible that I was expecting that shell toss ability because I played the first game, or not. Because, like, it seems so familiar to me, but I can't tell if I'm remembering this game, or, like, I'm just confused. Why are you leveling up? The first time I leveled up, the reason I brought it up was, um, I, I immediately got health the first time. Yeah. But it, it told me it liked, I liked confidence, right? So it just, it made me feel like I like confidence as a person. And wow. it really made me question it. Like, I was just like, wow, do I like confidence? Like, it really hit me, you know? Wow. So then I just, I started getting flower power for a really long time. <laughs> and then I got a lot of badge power. If I hold X, it'll just post up right there and I can get out of the way. Mm hmm Let's see what the the party menu says about him. Timid Koopa who wants to be tougher for his girlfriend Koopy Koo. Press X to shoot out his shell and retrieve just items. After shooting out his shell, you can also hold X to hold the shell. Alright. I saw an item, like a badge back there that we can go get if we go back. Yeah. I think you needed to go back and get it. Wait, is it this way? I don't remember what Because I remember about. seeing one re really early on there was one at like the top of a Oh! Pipe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's... Um, That's gosh. like back in the. It's above this, I think. It's above one of those blocks. Which yeah, block it, was it that above? one was underwater, I think, or in the, no. under the city. It's yeah, I think it was it. 
Bye, Zabarok. Thanks for hanging out. That was tight. Oh, yeah, that was his uh, first time watching you, too. Aw. Cool. I'm just, like, not even looking. I'm just running and jumping and getting away from everybody. You need to get that badge, though. All right, everyone wants me to go back one screen and get the badge, so we'll do that. It's close call, isn't it? Isn't that the badge? Don't I already have close call, though? No, it's not close call. Wait, is that um, HP plus? That sounds familiar from the first game. Is that someone texting us being like, go get that badge? No, I know what you would think. It's just my mom saying, like, what time are you going home? Alrighty. Bop, bop. Alright. Yeah, you have to go back. To this? To the left? Yeah, the it's right? at the, to the left. It's at the pipe. Oop, nibbles. Okay. We got nibbled. Well, you actually lose a health for that. Mm-hmm. didn't even realize. What happens if you die that way? Alright. You just die. There's the pipe. It was at the long pipe. Oh, it was the long pipe. I don't remember. I don't remember. I'll go is. back. We were just there. Too. Yeah, it's. I think it's to the left here. Azriel says you should quit at video games. <laughs> I give up on video games for forever. The thing is that Twitch is like super delayed, so there they're seeing what happened like 30 seconds ago. You're right. Uh, leave me alone. Uh -huh. I still got him. <laughs> yeah, the chat is really getting worked up over you not getting this badge. We'll get the badge. Um. <coughs> <coughs> yes. God, Koops makes taking out, like, groups of really tedious Ooh. enemies awesome. Holy shit. Yeah. He's like a living item. Mm-hmm. Koops is so great. Negascoot says, I'm gonna start the game up and get the dang badge myself. <laughs> what if you just didn't get it? Ever? That'd be funny. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm at the long shell. I don't see anything super interactive. Oh no, no, it's the it's the little pipe. You have to get on go through the little pipe, I think. Right? Okay. Am I wrong? No, I'm right. Oh, oh okay. I remember. There we this. go. Boom. Happy heart. Yay! Oh, that's sick. Yeah, it's a really good one. That's gonna be thousands of health over the course of this game. <laughs> let me let me get the, some badges equipped here. Happy heart, you have just know? You, where did this to use multi bounce too? <coughs> People are really proud of you for getting that badge. Like a giant weight has been lifted off their shoulders. Like part of me feels like these people could never be complete if you didn't get that badge. I know. Like I think we should just load a save state where I don't have the badge and then just continue on. <laughs> Wow, this would be awesome if you had like a tower that let you kill a lot of things that had small amounts of health. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, nerds. It's, it's so good. So awesome. So incredibly good. That's like as good as in Earthbound when you've conquered an area and you can just chase down enemies and they just give you points just for just chasing you just, them down. You just touch them and they fall over, right? Yeah, you just like walk up behind them and they just like fade away like it's over. Wait, where am I going? Uh, go back. Okay. Well, you should save it, yeah. Is there fast travel eventually in this game? Mm-hmm. Okay. Sean, where did those emotes come from? Are those like dodgers? Those are cat girls. Yeah. Do you know what you're doing right now? Nope. Go back. Get back. Go to the left? Back. The left. So remember when you went to Schwank's Fortress to get a thing? Yes. Who and was I doing that for? For to go to the castle. You put the... Oh, there's holes in them shaped like the stuff. Thank you. Thank you for the hints. Uh, Afropower is comparing. He's saying, is Ladybo cuter than Goombella? It's I think, like, Goombella, Goombella's cute and Ladybo's hot. That's the difference. Okay, I mean, I thought Ladybug was cute and it made me hot, per se. Oh. Well, you have not seen the same flash animations I've seen. <laughs> God, oh. I was watching Wak- I didn't tell you! I was watching Wakfu, and um... Oh, I know what to do. Yeah. And I was talking to my friend about it, and uh, we were talking about it and stuff, and she was like... 
she was like, you know, I feel like I've seen this, but I, I know. Oh my god, no way. Yeah, she's <laughs> also seen the, the same porn. And then actually my, my boss, too. We were also talking about it. So it turns out I think everyone has seen that, the zone that porn of walkthrough, walkthrough? of the That's same so girl. Oh my god. Except for me. <laughs> That's hilarious. I'm not clicking that DeviantArt link. That does not seem wise. It's called Bow Ball Bound by Blogman. I feel like I know what that is. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way, see if there's anything cool. Any cool secrets over here. No? I mean, maybe the other direction. 3 says, yeah, exactly. Ladybug was sensual, not just hot. <laughs> Oh, that's weird. It's not that bad. Yep. There we go. We clicked it. <laughs> it did happen. I saw it. You know what's weird? In my peripheral vision, I thought that spring was Millhouse. <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I thought Millhouse was hiding behind the pole, peeking out. <coughs> He'll never be a meme. True. <coughs> God, that's such an old meme. Super old meme. Millhouse not being a meme is like... <laughs> we were We were kids when that was a thing. <laughs> Oh, they're up in the pricing here. It's up to six coins now. Can I just jump out the window? Jellyfield Zombie said that she's a classy lady, and he's absolutely right. That's what Lady Bo is. That's that's the difference between Lady Bo and Goombella. Goombella's like, like your sassy like college friend. Mm -hmm. Like she's like your your, like your ideal college girlfriend. And right. then like Lady Bo is like, like your lady. Like. Lady Bo is like. She's like you aspire to be with her, but you probably can't. She was like dream like wifey. Yeah, right. yeah, she's like dream wifey. Oh fuck! Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, I made it. Bootler is great too. My house is a meme. Is not a meme. Is a meme. I can't believe I said a meme. I'm really mad at myself. Oh fuck! <laughs> the enemies in this game are so fast. Well, I can't hit any of them with my shell thing now, right? Mm mm. Or my hammer. Nope. But I've got this new multi bounce. If I Ooh. can get this timing right. Nope! <laughs> Super can't. <coughs> oh. You're just beating the shit out of me, huh? Halo FedEx Halo E FedEx Ben is asking if we're dating and no, we're not. No, we're super not. I got that comment a lot on our last video too. Did you really? Yeah. That's really funny. I need to just do a vi video with Victoria. Yeah, you should. You guys should do rhythm heaven. I agree. She's playing that for the first time and she's like probably No Fuck, wait, what'd I do? He's gonna throw you with mushrooms. Oh, mushroom. I beat the shit out of that toad. Yeah, I know. Victoria is like a natural at Rhythm Heaven more than anyone else I've ever met. That's awesome. I'm very impressed. All right, I feel light. like that's a really hard game to be natural at. I'll light these fools up. Also, oh, you didn't time that good. Oh, now he's on his back. Ooh. I guess it's only fair that that applies. <laughs> Fuck bouncing! I'm literally, I'm running all the way back to the end of the game and I'm buying that badge that you wouldn't let me buy. I need it. Kumbella is probably the better partner for Koopa Troopas. Side X is right. I mean, what I like to do, well... It depends on how you, on your playing style. Victoria has pink hair, blue hair? No, Victoria is blonde, right? No. Yeah. Yes. Are they confusing her with someone? I don't know. She's like the only girl in my life who doesn't have anime hair, basically. Huh, makes sense. Yes! There we go. Fuck this nerd. Will you get up? Thank you. Alright, cool. Make him kill his own brethren. I mean, are they brethren? Sort of. What happens if I don't ever let go? Oh, it just does it itself. Okay. I just heard that sound, it, that's what happened. I heard that sound wrapping up and I was like, I wonder if that means something. 
What is that icon? Hope. Hype. Hope? Yeah, it's <laughs> the no Obama 08 campaign yeah, poster, know, like, but with what? a swole muscle. I don't know what mag press is either. You don't know what it is? It's like a... Oh, I'll fight this dude now. It's like West Virginia or DC or something. Okay, that's hella far. Thunder Bay is laughing about hope. I kind of want to make like a hope emote. God, you're so good at sweet treat. I just, I've never been good at it. It's weird to see oh, it no. from high school. Is that a gasp or like a burp? It was a gasp, but it was in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> my legs are falling asleep. From all this Mario. <laughs> yeah, Mario son is right. I I feel bad because like people are like, oh you should have done this, and you should have done that. And it's like it's true, and I could tell you to do these things, but I don't want to because you're playing it. I think I, I think I kind of appreciate that actually. It's like this, if I, if I ever get like stumped and I'm start starting to do horrible, then it'll make sense to just be like, no, you need to do this. But yeah, I just stop you if it's like. I'm gonna learn my own lessons, right? Yeah, if you're like going the wrong way, and I can tell you're just like bullshitting, and I'm like, no, this is gonna take forever. Yeah. Just, just go left. I'm good at everything except the jump timing. I don't know why I struggle with the jump timing. I really don't. Oh fuck you, dude! I can't interrupt this, huh? It just like happens randomly. Yeah. All I did was. Why did I get health from it though? I don't know. Cause like me, Mario also doesn't really fuck with this Goomba dude that much. What the scoop? What? This or Koopa? <laughs> Mario's also like hell yeah. All right. I'm gonna knock him on his butt. Does he miss a turn when I do that? Hype. Stop doing Boom. this! Hype bumping. Okay, yeah, what's around their bag? It's way easier. I'm waiting for someone to make a joke out of that because I realized after like I started saying it. <laughs> give, give them like 25 seconds. They're all listening you say it as you speak, and <laughs> then know. they're gonna type it in. I started to say it, and I was like, oh, I gotta finish. They're gonna do something with that. I yeah. know, I know. I... It keeps happening. Is my phone like in my butt? Yeah, it is. Blue sticker. Wow, where, who, what channel has all these awesome <laughs> emotes? Um, you wanna see something crazy? Yeah, I do. Cause it's like getting dark in here. Yeah, it is. Uh. Whoa, that was cool. Whoa. <laughs> this is stupid. Yeah, this is hella dumb. This is the stupidest thing in the world. I got it a couple Christmases ago. <laughs> it's supposed to be like three light bulbs, but two of them stopped working. I, I don't show people this when I first meet them because I feel like this is the type of thing that like Austin Powers will have or Quagmire <laughs> either, <laughs> either way I hit my head but yeah that is your answer was good too All right, I'm gonna heal up real quick <laughs> nope wrong power oh shit <laughs> I, I, my instinct is to press up and down not left and right <laughs> You need Smooth Jazz Pro. Bro. I like Smooth Jazz Pro. That sounds like... <laughs> That's a good username. That's a yeah. good Twitch handle. <laughs> Wait. I'll just keep taking my money even when I'm my health Yeah. Screen? Rude. <laughs> just watch you not fuck this up this time, hopefully. Yeah, I got it. 
What are you doing? I'm trying to get up here. <laughs> uh. This dude looks like he's hurt all the time, even when he's not. Even when he's at full health. I don't like fighting these guys. Yeah, I don't like fighting Koopas either. It's annoying. They like they're so time consuming. Unless I nail the timing. Wow! Holy shit! There you go! Who am I? There you go. No, I'll hit him with a quick. Earlier, somebody, I think it was Rayo son actually, that was saying that Gumbella is a lot easier to use in these fights against Koopas. Oh, okay. But, like I said, it had to do with strategy because if you use Gumbella, it is it is easier in the sense that you're jumping, but if you do stuff like that and then you have Koops, then I think it's a lot easier, personally. Oh, you know what that health was? It's I got that badge that just randomly heals me during combat a little bit. 3D Tony says, I don't show people this when I meet them. I think he's practiced that line before. How about the lights? Yeah. <laughs> I don't let just anyone see these lights. <laughs> that was such a close call. The timing was like still technically green, but it counted. Uh-oh. Here we go. Do I press a button? Yeah. Oh, that would have been super helpful. That would have been so nice. So at 1 FP right now? Mm-hmm. Don't want enemy until you miss. Okay, so that's kind of what we were talking about with the Super Mario RPG thing, where you can just keep jumping forever. Right. Ooh, we can get this money. <laughs> I think we both leaned in at the same so time. So dumb. I just realized there's more Coke Zero. Coke Zero? Coke. Coke Zero. Oh no! They look a lot like all the other skeletons. I feel like I know where this is going. But well, that's his shoes. His dad's bones. It's really sad when he was playing his dad's bones. This is important. I'm really enjoying everyone's reactions to Coop's finding his dead father. They're reading his final letter. Colorado. <laughs> Wait, his... Oh, <laughs> this is the second time Colorado's come up, though. It is. It is the second time. I, I realized that afterwards, uh, Professor Colorado. <laughs> Look at his little blushy mark. That Oops. is adorable. Spread the letter from someone else's dead dad. Haha. -ha. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. Was, and I was Awkward. wondering if this is his dad or this. Which one is your dead dumb dad? Your dumb, your dumb dick dad. <laughs> Bone castle. We're going to the bone zone. Oh fuck! They really like this trick, huh? Yeah, they do. I do too. Um, this is the part that I, for some reason, thought I, I still feel like you could have done it with the X knots earlier. Oh but, yeah. Yeah, isn't that awesome? That is so awesome. <laughs> so cool. I keep seeing little things like Mario folding up and smashing through these guys with a hammer that I feel like they used in a trailer for this game. Oh, and then you saw it. Yeah. You know what I kind of wish right now? I like how the Thunder Bay really quick is like, wow, cool, it's not my dad. Yeah. <laughs> That's basically what just happened. Like, oh, thank God. He's my dad's someone, fine. Someone, someone else's shitty dead dad. <laughs> All right. I want to see what she says about this. She just grossed out by it. Oh, I wanted to hear what she would say about him. This part sucks. At least you have her out already. Oh, actually, Piranarama 
Her Piranha Rama, yeah, that's cool. Um, says this was the part you could play in the demo for the game at places like Walmart, so maybe that's where you're gonna Maybe, get yeah. A oh, red bones. Wow, this is fucked up. So I should kill his friends first so it doesn't summon itself back to life, but it can also summon more friends. Mm-hmm. Hard. Yeah, these are really annoying. Do your allies have separate HP? <laughs> huh? Like, if I swap her out for my dude? Yeah, no, they don't share the same HP. If I could get multi bounce to work right now. Oh, but I'm out of the Do you pot. have uh, any syrup? Uh, <laughs> um, you could. <laughs> his appeal sucks. It does. He looks like an idiot. You know, his appeal is adorable. Say it. Oh, that dude? Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to see it, but I really want to use his attack. Yeah, his attack is really important. Except for, I need to appeal first to get enough points to use his attack. I gotta look at this asshole again. <laughs> oh wait, no, I gotta- oh shit, I did that wrong. Wait, really? Huh. Nothing. I was out of FP. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Harder to block it when you don't know who they're targeting. All right, so Mario's gonna use this. No. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Remember that time where it was really weird that you gained HP? Yeah, I figured it was. That out. Yeah, it was bad. Duh. <laughs> I said that. Like, oh, you did? Yeah, like five oh. minutes ago. Oh, I wasn't listening. All right. What's up with all these like dude, these little dudes with three hairs in the audience? No three bones. Oh. The audience changes depending on your location. Mm. Nice. Kind of. <laughs> that doesn't do anything. Oh, they brought a cannon into the crowd. Or something. Stylish. Oh, I just did my first stylish. Did you? What was the timing? Who was it? Yeah, hit. It was a uh, that dude. Oh, Kips. Yeah, Kips has really cute timing. There you go. I did it twice. Yeah. What? Stylish. It's so important. Yeah. That's nice. That's a nice, hefty amount of points. That's a lot of experience. Got me most of the way to level four. Alrighty, how long have we been doing this? Like three hours? Really? Only? Yeah, like three Only. hours. Unless we like stopped and started at one point. Okay. Oh god. You should definitely save. Yeah? Soon, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to get a burrito. Although this will be easy if you had flower power in anyway. Fuck! <laughs> if you had flower power. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's see. Look how cute that is. It's pretty cute. I'm so excited. I'm grinding a peel right now. I like when Bella was here. There's a badge that's super nice where um, when you equip it, you don't have to... Like when you switch your partners out, you don't have to wait a turn for them oh, to be able to do something. Oh, fuck. That sounds like it changes the game. It does, but also it's like, it's a lot of points.
So the bigger the audience is, the more appeal you can get? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you expand the audience by like hitting all of your commands, usually. So like stylish points get you more audience members too. Whatever. I'm about to get so much health off this ability, I ain't even mad. Just beat up these nerds. Whoops! Oh. Another gas? <laughs> yeah, that was the same the same noise. <coughs> mm. Oh. Six six six! Wow, perfect. If there should be a thumbnail for the stream, it should be that. Like in the future. Yes. Only one damage? Oh, they only have one health. Okay. <laughs> but like a ton of defense. <coughs> yeah. Oh, hurry, pick that up real quick. Ooh, got to cop this ish. Mm -hmm. Oh, shiny sprite. I think these will help. They don't want to. Dang. Some of these, so some of these are actually just corpses, but then some of them are like disguised dry bones. Mm hmm. It's like a survival horror game where you can't tell if they're actually dead or. <laughs> I don't think there's a save block for a little bit. Mm. Orange Apple is asking if we read the chat here. Nope. Mm -mm. Yeah. Found a little secret. Oops. How's he do with that? I don't get the physics of that. The physics of just like floating in midair mm -hmm. and being a Koopa and hitting stuff. I mean, Coop's gonna uh, already defy physics in a lot of ways, like his hoodie and his shell. <laughs> True. Alright. What the fuck? What were you trying? It's to launch him into the air forever so I never have to see him again. Am I missing something? Yeah. Oh shit. No, that's uh, I mean, okay, so I don't want to tell you what to do, but um, just there you go. So that yellow ball. Oh, it's like be... a. I can use it to get up here. Yeah. You can make that jump. Ah. All right. There you go. Cool. Now you're good. Oops. Have you ever watched a speed run of this game? Mm-mm. Well, that would be cool. It's probably dope. Whatever. Yeah, can't hurt me. <laughs> That's cool. Have you played Fez? Mm-mm. What's that? Oh, we should play that. Okay. You would love that. I like games that I would love. It's a yeah. If you like games you would love, you would love this one. Yeah, I like games that I love. For some reason, everybody always knows my my like type of thing that I will like. Are they usually correct? Yeah. No, usually yeah. Like if someone says like, oh, you would just love this, I usually do. Like it's like it's like when I said I love Adventure Bros, and you're like, oh, it's, yeah, it's makes sense. Like, like, it's, oh hey, Stream Little just subbed. Thank you. Thank you for your support. That's dope. I'm currently in the process of getting emotes made, so if you guys have suggestions, <coughs> let me know. Ah. Oh, it's okay. I didn't. I didn't realize until just a second that it was like. I thought you just had to wait a while for it to come back. No. Chill. 
People like honking in the city. Yeah, they do. God, you should have seen me trying to find parking. That took like a legitimate I, half an hour. I could tell you exactly how long it took. <laughs> You the can. first time you called me when you were like, I'm here, but I can't find parking. <coughs> that was... I mean, I had already been looking for like five, six minutes. Because I had already gone around the block a few times. I have three calls with you. At 12.55, you called me like, hey, I can't find parking. And I was like, oh, you just keep looking. And then your next call that, where you're like, I can't find... Oh, I found it. That was after... Oh, five. <laughs> Fifteen. So like... Hold on. Like 16 minutes? Something like that? That's pretty bad. That's a lot of minutes. Hmm. Do I have the ability to get this yet? No. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're very good at, like, meeting out advice at a good pace. I appreciate it. You haven't told me anything yet that I didn't want to know. But... Cool. I'm glad you enjoy it. I try really hard <coughs> not to be one of those people. Alrighty. Um, I think we should eat dinner. I want dinner. Okay. I didn't say din dins. Were you how was that a was there a risk of that? <laughs> was there a chance? Was. was there a chance you were gonna say din dins? I just stopped myself. Alrighty. Well, people already have suggestions for Twitch emotes. Oh cool. Grayed out Waluigi instead of Kappa or Nick cool. Face but with Waluigi. I wonder if people remember back in like the Rev three days. There were people who weren't used to Twitch streaming who would come to our chats and see the cap emote and be like, is that just an emote of, like, Nick's head? Mm -hmm. Cheese cheese string emote. That's a great idea. <laughs> I've, we've been talking about that for a while. Um, word. Alrighty. Dindins. 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 Nick hates it when I say dindins. <laughs> did, have we established that before? You did. You told me. You said never say that again when I said dindins. When was that? I have a bad memory. Message. Yeah, I know. Oh, via text, it's especially gross. <laughs> Ugh. I like Dindins. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Alrighty. Well, we are gonna go eat mm -hmm. dinner. 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 And we will <laughs> see you guys. Uh, you want to do this again a week from today? Do you think that'll work? Yeah, I can do that. Cool. We'll yeah. see you guys Wednesdays at 3 p.m. for Paper Mario. Yeah, Captain Tony. No, I do. What? Captain Toadie, no, 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 no. Oh, hell yeah. That'd be cute. Okay. Alright, bye all. Bye, thank you.